Maria, umejane ma bwana yu nawe, umebarikiwa kulikuwa na wake wote, na yesu mzao wa tumbulaka umebarikiwa. Maria mtakatifu mama wa mungu, utuombe sisi wa kosefu, sasa na saya kupa kwetu. Atukuse baba na mwana na roo mtakatifu, mwanzo na sasa na siku zote na mirele mirele. E Mungu Baba Mwenyezi, twakushukuru kwa wema wako, twakushukuru kwa sababu ulimuumba huyu mtumishi wako James Nyakundi. Ukamweka katika ulimwengu huu pamoja mwenda zake Nora, ili pamoja wakao wa umbaji na pia kulea tunakuomba Baba kwa vile sasa amekamilisha ile kazi ulimpa twaomba ili umrehemu umpe makao ya milele katika ufalme wako Baba Mwema. Wewe ndio una uh, tufariji kwa sababu sema tusisifai dhaiki mioyoni mwetu tujue ya kwamba mwana wa Yesu Kristo asa wakati tunakumbuka alikufa kafufuka na kwa wale wote ambao wamemwamini eh, kuna po tuambia kwamba yeyote anayenifuata yeyote anayenitumikia mahali nilipo mimi mtumishi wangu atakuepo akafanya kazi ya kukujua akakupenda akakutumikia katika familia na katika ile kazi ulimpa E, katika taifa letu e, baba mwema e, tuomba ili siku ya leo baba tumekuja ili kumusindikiza tunaomba uboke roho yake katika ufalme wako na uendelee kulinda familia yake watoto jamii yote ili waendelee kutumainia kila wakati na tunaomba hayo kwa njia Kristo bwana wetu atukuse baba na mwana na roho mtakatifu it are no rest grant unto you, my Lord. And may perpetual rest shine upon me, rest in peace. And Lord be to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and it shall be without us. It are no rest grant unto you, my Lord. And may perpetual light shine upon me, rest in peace. Buana awe nanyi. Awe bari kina kualinda. Mungu Baba. Mwana na Rom Takatifu. Amen. Poleni kwa familia Pole Father Oleni Tumetoka kisi kuta kwa fariji
kuongozwa nawe e, tuwe na amani yako ile tumalize na pia tunajua kuna wengi ambao wako njiani na wengine ambao watakaporudi ili turudi tukiongozwa nawe baba mwema tuachie kama mikono ni mwako uzidi kutubariki na ubariki familia kwa njia Kristo bwana wetu amen bwana awe nanyi awe baba na mwana na roho mtakatifu amina asamna isipo haya
kingine tena ninawakaribisha katika maeneo haya tuko katika wadi ya Masitima ward Molo constituency Wadi inaitwaje hii Elbagon thank you so much Elbagon karibu sana na kwa siku ya leo ni siku ambayo tunasherekea maisha ya mzee James Nyakundi aye kwa wakati wake Mungu aliona ni vema kwamba muite kutoka dunia hii la muhimu ni ile kazi ambayo mzee alifanya familia yake watoto wake na watu wa nyumbani wala bao alifanya kazi kwa ukaribu nao pia mzee James Nyakundi alifanya kazi kwa serikali ku akiwa ni mmoja wa viongozi wale ambao walikuwa wanalinda inchi na pia akiwa katika ile kiwango cha commissioner. Kwa hivyo kwa siku ya leo tunashukuru sana kwa kazi ambayo mzee alifanya kwa taifa letu la Kenya, kwa jamii yetu na sana sana ile kazi ambayo amefanya kwa kuwalea watoto wake ambao wamekuwa wa baraka kwa watu wengi. Kwa hivyo siku ya leo nawakaribisha kwa niaba ya familia ya mzee James Nyakundi kwa mara nyingine tena na karibisha kila mmoja wetu ile ambaye amepata nafasi kufika hapa hivi. Ambaye anaongoza katika sherehe ya siku ya leo ni Omo Iberania James Kichana. Nafanya na shirika la Royal Media Services kitengo cha Egesai FM. Wale ambao wamepata nafasi kusikiza radio Egesai FM, uh, Omo Iberania ni station manager. Nashukuru Mungu kwa sababu siku ya leo Ninae rafiki wa karibu Father Nyanga ambaye tumefanya kazi na yeye tukiwa katika maeneo ya Kisi, Nyamira na hata katika taifa letu la Kenya. Nashukuru Mungu kwa sababu ya viongozi wa makanisa wale wote ambao wamewakilisha leo tukiwa katika ile hali ya kusherekea na kuongoza ibada ya wafu ya ndugu uh, mzee James Nyakundi. Na kwa mara nyingine kwa niaba ya familia watoto wa mzee marafiki wote wale ambao wametoka Kisi timu ambayo imetoka Nairobi na wa... Amina. Ngependa e, kusoma e, kutoka barua ya mtakatifu Paulo kwa Warumi na hiyo ni 14 saba hadi tisa Kwa vile hakuna anayeishi kwa nafsi yake mwenyewe, hakuna anayekufa kwa nafsi yake mwenyewe. Tukiishi tuishi kwa Bwana. Tukifa wafa kwa Bwana. Kwa hivyo leo hii tumekuja hapa ili kumba mkono wa Briani huyu ni baba, babu ambaye e, katika familia Mwenyezi Mungu akamuita pamoja na mwenda zake Nora Mora Nyakundi ili waweze kuwa waumbaji pamoja na Mwenyezi Mungu wamefanya na kuitekeleza hiyo kazi na leo tuko hapa kwa mashahidi kwamba amelala na ni wakati ambapo tunakumbuka Yesu mshindi kwa sababu yeye alikuja ulimwenguni atuonyeshe nje ya kwenda kwake baba tuomba ili Mwenyezi Mungu atubariki na abariki siku ya leo kwa wageni wote ambao wameingia ili kuifariji familia hii Mwenyezi Mungu 
azidi kubariki kila mmoja na tutakapomaliza sherehe zetu za leo e, pia kuongoza kufika salama nyumbani e, Mungu Baba tukushukuru kwa wema wako tukushukuru kwa sababu ulimuomba huyo James nya rienga mbaa melala ukamuita kama mtoto wako katika upatizo na tunaomba baba tuwajue ya kwamba wewe una huruma isiyo na mwisho unatenda ya haki na ya ukweli kwa sababu hayo ndio yanakupendeza umlaki katiki asante sana kwa kuitikia wimbo na kazi ambayo umefanya tushukuru na kwa sasa nikubalie sasa nimuite Leonida atubariki na wimbo mmoja ikiwa katika ile hali ya kuwakaribisha nyinyi wote wale ambao umepata nafasi kufika hapa siku ya leo Leonida ako wapi naomba Leonida karibie huko mbele utubariki na wimbo na kwaya kwaya naomba tafadhali muwe eh, katika standby tubariki na wimbo tukiwa karibu sana Leonida Leonida akiwa anatubariki na wimbo Uh, na kisha baadaye ikiwa uko pale na wewe ni mwimbaji ama kuna kwaya ambayo imefika naomba tafadhali ukaweze kujiandikisha pamoja na mimi hapa kio wewe ni mwimbaji ama wewe ni kwaya naomba upate nafasi kujiandikisha pamoja na sisi hapa hivi itakuwa vizuri haya tupate kazi ya Leonida wa mitambo akiwa anatupatia sauti tuenda imani dhabiti kwamba Yesu yuwaja wachukua wote ule walopiga vita vya imani ndugu kupilia mateso ya dunia na yote yanayo umiza moyo agano la bonali wazi na kifo kitakwisha mateso ya dunia na yote yanayo umiza moyo agano la bonali wazi na kifo kitakwisha na tujipe moyo ndugu tusilie sana mateso ya dunia ni sote tutasahau tufika po mbinguni kwa baba tutafurahi sisi sisi tutakanya katara tibu na kukishuja tukikaribe shumbinguni kwa baba yetu akitulaki kwa shangwa na furaha karibu kwangu na tujipe moyo ndugu tusilie sana Mateso ya dunia ni sote tutasahau Tufika po, mingu ni kwa baba Tutafurahi Sisi sisi Takanya kata Tibu na kukishuja Tukikaribe shumbingu
tunasema tuseme amen kabisa kanisa tunasema bwana yesu asifiwe tumsifu yesu kristu milele na milele asante sana bwana usemu yangu katika Safari yangu tatembe yana wewe Bam Ana wewe katika safari yangu tatembe yana wewe Niongoze safari ni mbele huko nichukue Nango ni mwambingu ni ingie na pamoja pamoja na wewe pamoja na wewe katika safari yangu tatembeana asante sana asante sana ningependa kutambua uh, uh, wageni wetu wale ambao wametoka Machakos County wale ambao wametoka Machakos County kwenye dada Doris ameolewa tunawakaribisha karibu sana Elbagon. Pia ningependa kutambua wageni wetu wale ambao wametoka Kitui County. Wageni wale ambao wametoka Kitui County kwenye Regina ameolewa karibu sana. Tunashukuru na asante sana kwa kusafiri kutoka mbali. Pia napenda kuwatambua wageni wetu wale ambao wametoka Meru County uh, kwenye ndugu Cosmos ameoa. Wageni wetu wale ambao wametoka Meru County karibu sana. Uh, tunawatambua kabisa. Na pia ningependa kutambua wageni wale ambao wametoka Nyamira County Gachuba kwenye CPA na pia wageni kutoka Nairobi marafiki wa CPA Obuge tunawakaribisha kabisa karibu sana uh, maeneo haya ya Eribagon. Pia ningependa kutambua kikundi kikubwa kimetoka kule Kitengela Nairobi Kisinya Group wakiongozwa na mzee eh, Kamau Asante sana kwa kusafiri kutoka mbali sana na kufika hapa siku ya leo tunawakaribisha asante kwa uwepo wenu. Na kwa sasa ningependa mnikubalie sasa ni kaweze kuwatambua yule ambaye atakuwa anatupatia ufunguzi ya na tribute 
mtu ambaye wamemzaa ni mtu ambaye wametembea mzee kwa ukaribu yeye ndiye alikuwa mtu ambaye alimsaidia wakati akifanya harusi Edward Mwamba amefanya kazi na yeye lakini anamjua vizuri Edward tafadhali mahali popote huko ningependa ukaribie huko Okay Karibu sana Edward Asante sana leo Kwa majina vile mnasikia ni Edward Mwamba Uh, huyu marehemu tumetembea naye kwa muda mrefu hizi wakati tuliandikwa askari tuliandikwa pamoja tarehe sita mwezi wa 11 1967 kwa hivyo tukaendelea naye tukaenda huko Galisa wakati huko huko Galisa historically kwa Kikristo mimi nilibatizwa nikiwa mdogo nikajua hali ya Kikatoliki kwa hivyo na yeye akawa interest kuingia kuwa Mkatoliki wakati tuko kule 1969 ngao tu askari constables ngasimamia yeye akapata upatiso kuanzia siku hiyo nyakundu vile sasa unaona kina patri wanaendelea ku kisa yake leo tumetembea na yeye ukiwa kutoka kiganjo haya hali ya promotion wakati naenda mimi nilitangulia kupata promotion Wanyakundi kapata inspector alafu mnyakundi akaona eh hey, rafiki yangu namna gani baadaye nyakundi akakasana mimi pia nikiwa inspector kule kiganjo about five years nyakundi akaona wivu akasema hii hey, rafiki yangu sasa amepata promotion namna gani na haya akakasana mpaka nyakundi sasa bila narara huko is assistant commissioner of police mtu mkubwa na mimi nikawaachiwa huko wajibu inspector. Tumeritaya tuko pamoja, tunaishi pamoja. Then the funny thing in 1976 wakati mimi nafanya harusi, then a family hiyo tu ndiye ilikuja kusimamia. Bila tumeenda nayo mwendo mrefu. Kule na Arobi bila naishi ke naishi kule Kitengera, asante watu wa Kitengera. Mimi pia naishi kule Kasarani lakini hatuwezi kusahau vile mvorani hapa amesema KC wetu ni KC hata hapa baadhi tuko kila wakati kama mimi nakungua kama polisi yangu ni St Gabriel uko bitiacha kule hata hii 10% inatolewa asimo nitoa huko naitoa hapa la mwisho ningora ningrua si sana 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 wale atendizi ya leo hapa Mungu iko upende ukose kupenda Mungu hata kama wewe ni Muislamu wewe ni kanisa Protestant don't mind we are on the rest tuone kama tufiki kwa Mwenyezi Mungu vile nyakundi all these years we are much together na wakati anaenda kukufa the short story tichua in December nikiwa kasi aliniita kule katengera kwaenda tukarara tukaongea mambo mengi sana na yeye akaniambia siri nyingine huko huko na uh, ile kitu nilitangulia uh, February kama amepata upako ya wagonjwa najua sisi katoliki ukiona kama wewe unaendelea kuvifia namna hii usiogope kupakwa mafuta na patri hiyo eta utakufa au utaendelea ah uh, yangu ni ile ya kuwa alipakwa hiyo mafuta after about two uh, two weeks huko uh, vile dalara kule akakani sisi kwa nia ya family kwa ni watu wamekuja kwa hivi nyakundi nafikiri sisi hatuwezi kujaji Mungu ndiye anajaji but we are hoping that ye yeah, ameendekea huko bali kwa maana amefanya chochote ile mkatoliki au mkristiano angelifaa kufanya kwa hayo machache karibuni tuendelee na sera yake asante asante sana asante sana ndugu Edward eh, Mwamba ambaye ni rafiki wa mzee wametembea na yeye mate. na ni muhimu sana wakati rafiki anapomomboleza eh, rafiki wake kwa utangulizi 
And tukiendelea hivyo tungependa kutambua vile vikundi ambavyo vimevika. Uh, kuna kikundi kimetoka uh, Keroka. Keroka nafikiri Keroka iko kwa boda ya Nyamira na Kisi County. Uh, kwenye ndugu Elvin Nyakundi. Uh, ah yeah. hiyo kikundi kinawakilisha ndugu uh, Elvin Nyakundi. Kuna kikundi kimetoka Manga, Nyamira County, kwenye Samuel Mukaya. Eh uh, wakiwa na Samuel Mukaya, Nyamira team. Asante sana kufika. Pia tuko na CMAK ambao wanawakilisha kanisa uh, wale ambao tunaita ni uh, viongozi wale wa eh, baba mkatoliki eh CMA K kabisa asante kwa kuwakilisha tunawatambua Asante kwa kutambua kikundi ambacho kimetoka Nyamira County wafanyikazi wa Nyamira County kwenye dada Teresa nyakundi anafanya kazi tunawatambua na karibu sana kwa kufika Erbagon naomba tafadhali wale ambao mnaingia mnaingia kwa utaratibu msisunguke kwa sababu mnaingia tu na tazama mwili alafu unapata nafasi ya kukaa hiyo red carpet imetengenezwa kwa sababu yenu kwa hivyo mnaingia tu kwa red carpet unatazama mwili alafu unapata nafasi ya kukaa na kwa vyumba vya usafi vyumba vya usafi nikiwa nimesimama hivi nikiwa nimesimama hivi tafadhali muniambie vizuri vyumba vya usafi kwa upande ule wa nyuma pale tuma tuko na vyumba vya usafi pale upande wa kwanza pale so for the ladies you can use the first two and then for the gents you can use the next two tuna kwa utaratibu tutazingatia hivyo na tutashukuru sana sasa ningependa nikaweze kutambua kwa sababu na na ba meniambia tukokote kuanzia sasa tutaanza na misa ningependa nitambue kile kikundi kimetoka Keroka Tim Keroka wako wapi ningependa mkuji haraka tafadhali tuone kama tunaweza kupatia nafasi Tim Keroka tafadhali kama mko pale mkuji hapa Tim Keroka if you are there please I'm trying to see if I can be able to fix all the teams Tim Keroka If you are there if you have naomba kusimame hapa Tim Keroka please so of time Tim Keroka if you are there we might not have enough time after mass naomba tu niwakilishe hivi vikundi vyote ambavyo nimetaja naomba representatives wa kutaka Tim Keroka if you are there Tim Keroka wa ile wale, wale ambao wanakilisha Elvin tafadhali mkuje Tim Keroka naomba Tim Keroka if you are there I just need one to represent Tim Keroka if one is there itakuwa vizuri fundi wa mitambo nasikia sauti bado inatusumbua kidogo kama Tim Keroka imefika itakuwa vizuri kwa sababu yes Keroka Asante sana kwa mwelekezi wangu. Nashukuru sana. Um, team um, Alvin Kunde mtakuja baadaye nitawaleta baadaye wakati naleta familia. Na kwa sasa ningependa niite team Kitengela. Team Kitengela wako wapi?
sa opisina. Uh, at the very end, we have Mr. Mbugo. Uh, is a member of the company, uh, Senior East Africa Limited. Uh, we have Dr. Natuo. Uh, we have Mr. Correll, principal. We have Wana Tuti. We have Wana Joseph. We have Mr. Maeka on Twitter. Then we have now the acting chairman. Uh, now that we have lost uh, our uh, Tukona Wana Humphrey Kamau, uh, Ana Tuku. Idea Tangia uh, because we are lost, uh, but uh, we thank God because we are. Uh, uh, Tukona Bonapita is uh, a nephew to our chairman and uh, a very strong member of the group. Tukona Bona Evans Mbane. Uh, these are very senior civil servants in departments that I don't need to disclose. Then we have Mr. John Onsongo, uh, also a cousin, first cousin. Chairman, a principal also. Uh, then we have Bwana Mujumbe, who has just joined us. Uh, the one of our members. Uh, Senior East Africa has 28 members. Uh, the ones you see here are just part of the group. Uh, we have very many. Uh, some are on the way coming. I believe Dr. Tina is about to arrive. Uh, Dr. Wafula is about to arrive. Uh, Engineer Kahoro, they are all there. In this group, we have people from all the parts of this country. We have all professions uh, represented in this group. Uh, I'll take a little more time. I'll take a little time because we have lost our friend. Just allow me some five minutes. Uh, the testimony I'm giving here. Thank you. Uh, the testimony this group gives to the congregation that is here is the kind of person Yakundi was. Uh, if you look at the faces and the names I've given you, uh, we have every part of this country represented. Tuko na waloya, tuko na masai, tuko na wajaluo, tuko na watu wanafanya kazi ya kila ina. Madaktari, engineer, uh, officers, and we don't just have people who live in Kenya, we have people who are even outside this country. So, Thank you so much for this opportunity and may God bless you. Tunyakundi's family, receive our condolences. We are with you in the, this journey and don't fear approach. Thank you so much. Asante sana, asante sana mwakilishi wa team uh, Isinya. Mungu wa bariki sana. Minto team, tafadari, minto team, where are they? Minto team, kuti hapa. Now, minto team, you will not do introduction. Just one of you to give a uh, just a minute uh, tribute and then on behalf of Minto team kuja msimame hapa hawa ni wakilishi kwenye mzee alikuwa anafanya kazi na vikundi mbalimbali mbali. kile kikundi yeye ndiye alikuwa chairman na hiki kikundi alikuwa member so these are Minto team i would like to usher in the chair chairman please you take it over from there karibu asante sana master of ceremony hii kikundi kinaitwa Minto self help group kiliundo wa mwaka jana na tuko members wengi lakini wengi wengi wao wako kwa njia watatujoin uh, mimi ndio chairman eh uh, naitwa Rafael engineer Rafael Ogen uko na secretary Mr. tuko na treasurer Benson Yonji eh uh, kwa niaba ya group kwa niaba ya hii group eh, na huyu eh huyu mzee ambaye amelala alikuwa member ya hii group ndio sababu tuko hapa 
na nataka tu niseme ni quotes philippines chapter 4 verse 4 inasema to the lord and it is, i say it again the choice always to the lord so on behalf of this group na nata rambela kwa na tu eh familia yake yote tunao pole tutaendelea kusaidiana asante mungu awabariki asante sana minto team mungu awabariki sana na kwa sasa narifiwa kwamba wakati wa misa umefika na mimi sina budi kupeana kipasa sauti kwa kanisa Mungu yu mwema. Mungu yu mwema. Kwa hivyo wakati huu tujiandae kwa misa na ningeomba sisi wote tushiriki kikamilifu kama unakofia uvue na simu tuweke silent mood ama tuzime mpaka video tamariza misa. Kwa hivyo si wote tushiriki. Fanyike duniani kama mbinguni. Tupeleo kutusamehe makosa yetu. Salamu Maria.
Bwana tunakuomba usikilize kwa wema sala zetu ili kama vile imani yetu katika mwana mfupuka kutoka wapo inavyoimarishwa vivyo hivyo tumaini letu la kutazamia ufupuko wa mtumishi wako James ya kundi jariena apate kushiriki wokovu wa milele na ufufuko wa mtumishi wako kwa njia bwana wetu Yesu Kristo mwanao anayeishi na kutawala nawe katika umoja wa Roho Mtakatifu Mungu daima na milele Pia fadha hiyo Mike. Nakuja mbele yangu na kuita hata Ya 
Sama la kwanza, sama katika kitabu cha hikuma ya Sulaimani. Wao zao wenye haki wamba mkononi wa mungu, wala maumivu hayata haya wabisa. Machoni kwa hatu wanyo wa jula wajiorekana kwa mba wamekufa na kufadiki kwa kudibaniwa ni kuwa ni asira yao. Na kusafiri kwa kutoka kwetu ni uharibifu wao, bali wao wenye wamo katika amani. Kwa sababu hata ikiwa wana, wana, wanavyo watu wanaadhibiwa. Hata hivyo, taraja lao limeja kutokufa na wakiisha wa kustaimili kurudia kidogo watapokea wingi wa neema katika nyuso zote na aibu ya watu wake ataionda katika ulimwengu wote. Maana bwana amenena hayo. Katika siku hiyo watasema, tazama, huyu ndiye mungu wetu, ndiye tulie mgoja atusaidie, huyu ndiye bwana tulie mgoja na tushangilie na kufuraia wakovu wake. Hilo ndilo neno la bwana. Zaburi ya kuitikizana Bwana ni nuru yangu na wakovu wangu Bwana ni nuru yangu na wakovu wangu Tutaimba hivi Mwana ni nuru yangu na wakovu wangu 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 Mwana Mwana ni nuru yangu na wakofu wangu Mwana ni nuru yangu na wakofu wangu Ni muwago pena ni Mwana ni ngombe ya uzima wangu ni muhovu nani Mwana ni nuru yangu na wakovu wangu Ni muhovu yangu na wakovu wangu Neno moja ni melitaka kwa mwana na londi loni taka loli tafuta Nikae nyumbani mwabwana Siku zote za maisha yangu Ni utazame uzuri wabwana na kutafakari karuni mwake Ni utazame uzuri wa mwana Na kutafakari karuni mwake 
Bwana ni nuru yangu na ukovu wangu Bwana ni nuru yangu na ukovu wangu E Bwana usiki kwa sauti yangu ninalia Unifadhili unijibu Mwana uso wako litautafuta Usinifiche uso wako Mwana ni nulu ya ukufu wangu Mwana ni nuru yangu na wokovu wangu Nami ni ya kuwarita uona wema wa mwana Katika inchi ya wali ohahi Umungu jibwana Uwe huda Mwana ni nuru yangu na wokovu wangu Mwana ni nuru yangu na wokovu wangu Viwande kwa naloka Yesu alikwenda mpaka mji mmoja uitwao Nain na wanafunzi wake walifuatana naye pamoja na mkutano mkubwa na alipo likaridia lango la mji hapo palikuwa na maiti anachukuliwa nje ni mwana pekee wa mamaye ambaye ni mjane na watu wa mjini wengi walikuwa pamoja naye Wana alipo muona alimuonea huruma akamwambia usilie akakaribia akarigusa jeneza wale waliokuwa wakirichukua wakasimama yule maiti akainuka akaketi akaanza hofu ikawashika wote wakamtukuza Mungu wakisema Nabii mkuu ametokea kwetu na Mungu amewaangalia watu wake habari hii yake ikaenea katika Uyahudi wote na katika inji zote za kando en Sifu Yesu Kristo na mjambo nyote Anaambia I'm coming there father. Niko na hii familia. Nikasema Mungu Mungu ni mwema. Mungu ni mwema. And then sometime in the evening at night nikaambiwa na father there's another priest who ananitumia anga hata mahubiri saa zingine. Father Nyanga. Na yeye kaniambia father I'm coming there. 
lakini uniwaje tu nitulie tu hivyo eh asante karibu father karibu hebu tupigie ama father wawili mako thank you na kuna wengine pia wangekuja lakini kwa sababu ya mambo mengi hawangeweza kufika siku ya leo lakini wako pamoja nasi wako pamoja nasi kabisa kwa sababu ya heshima ya mzee huyu James Nyakundi Nyakundi na familia sometimes kuna kitu wa ninashinda kuambia ti pole mumesikia pole nyingi kila saa pole pole mpaka hiyo jina amtai kusikia tena wacha tuseme wacha tuachilie mzee hapo muziki si ndio kwa amani eh tuseme pole sana pole ni ile tu kikawaida kibinadamu kwamba ni pole lakini sisi kama waamini tunakubali kwamba amepumzika na siku moja tutakutana naye siku ya leo ndugu zangu tumekuja karibu mheshimiwa kwanza <laughs> Hebu <laughs> tafutieni mheshimiwa mahali pa kukara haraka kabla nianze kuhubiri. Alafu nitawaambia mheshimiwa na <laughs> Karibu. Thank you. Situpige basi mheshimiwa makofi amefika. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Ndugu zangu. Somo letu la kwanza linatuelekeza mambo mengine mazuri sana na ni hekima ya Suleimani kama tujuavyo hekima ambayo Suleimani alikuwa nayo roho zao wenye haki wako wamo mkononi mwangu wala maumivu hayatawagusa roho ya James Nyakundi iko mkononi mwa Mungu sahizi Nataelezea. Matoni pa watu walio wajinga, hebu sikize hiyo. Matoni pa watu walio wajinga walionekana kwamba wamekufa. Kwa hivyo ikiwa sisi ni wajinga, tutaona kwamba meku. Sisi ni wajinga kweli? Ah sisi tunaamini, si ndio? Yes, tunaamini. Kwa hivyo na kufariki kwao kulidhaniwa kuwa ni hasara yao. Si hasara. Si hasara hakuna hasara hapa hata ukiangalia nyuma yangu hapa kando ukiangalia familia ambayo imebaki hapa kuna hasara hapa kweli siju msimame kidogo just stand simama hiyo ni hasara hiyo ni hasara kweli nyakundi hajakufa hajakufa hii ndio jeshi yake tuketi tafadhali eh hajakufa hajakufa nilienda mahali pengine wakasema wakati simba inakufa ilikuwa tamko la wanajeshi kwamba simba hiyo ijakufa kwa sababu imewacha tusimba twingi hiyo ni katika hali ya binadamu si ndio kwa hivyo nyakundi hajakufa kwa sababu hata ikiwa wana wao na ovyo watu wanaadhibiwa hata hivyo taraja lao limejaa kutokufa na wakiisha kustahimili kurudiwa kidogo watapokea wingi wa mema kwa kuwa Mungu amewajaribu ndugu zangu leo hii tumekuja kumzika ndugu yetu na kabla atujendelea sana kuna jambo ningetaka tufunzane leo na huwa kwa mazishi wa Kristo wetu hapa tumezoea kulisikia lakini kwa sababu ya wengine itabidi turudie kidogo na naomba tusikize sasa tuko darasani sasa na naomba tuingie darasani sasa huyu jamaa nyakundi amelala hapa na sisi tunaamini kanisa imegawanywa mara tatu kanisa imegawanywa mara ngapi kuna kanisa ambalo sisi wote tuko sasa kwa sasa ni kanisa ambalo linalo safiri hapa duniani. Na kanisa hilo linaitwa The Pilgrim Church. Kanisa la kuhiji. Ndio wewe na mimi. Na kanisa hili lina mambo mengi.
pia mateso mengi lina njaa lina ubinadamu wake linasafiri kwa mateso pia linasafiri kwa furaha pia linasafiri kwa ubinadamu wake sisi binadamu na hiyo ni zawadi kubwa sana Mungu alikupea wewe na mimi kuwa binadamu There's a reason why he never made you an angel akakufanya uwe nini binadamu furahia kuwa nini binadamu katika hali yako katika hali yangu ndio hiyo safari ya kuhiji sasa tuko safarini na safari hii pia huwa tunabatizwa kama wakristo tunafunguliwa kuingia katika nini kifo chake kristo na pia katika ufufuko wake nani kristo sisi kanisa la kuhiji tukisha toka kanisa la kuhiji tunaingia kanisa hili la pili the suffering church hebu semeni hivyo the suffering church kanisa ambalo linateseka linateseka kwa nini kwa sababu katika kanisa hili kanisa hili aliwezi kujiombea na kanisa hili ambalo limelala hapa kanisa hili linatolewa dhambi hapo ndipo kuoshwa kwa dhambi kuko na hiyo ndio imani yetu sisi wa Kristo Parigatorio Parigation mahali ambapo dhambi za Mkristo zinaondolewa zile ndogo ndogo kubwa kubwa ili aweze kuoshwa aweze kuingia katika utukufu wake nani Bwana na kanisa hilo ndio hilo hili ambalo sasa nyakundi ameingia na kanisa hili linatungojea sisi wote tena hakuna yule atakayeepuka na katika kanisa hili hata ukitazama jeneza hii hakuna yule mkubwa sana ambaye hawezi kutoshea hapa na kuna yule mdogo sana ambaye hawezi fanya nini kutoshea hapa hapo tutaingia tupende tusipende ni kwa sababu gani ni mahali pa kuoshwa tukisha oshwa dhambi zetu tunaingia sa la ushindi the triumphant church hebu rudieni the triumphant church kanisa gani la ushindi tukisha oshwa dhambi zetu tunaingia katika utukufu wake mwana Yesu Kristo na hapo ndipo tutakutana na Kristo ameketi anatuita kwake anasa hizi anaita James anamwambia oh James my son kuja uketi katika mkono wangu hapa na James na wengine John Jane wakishafika hapo tukishafika hapo tunakaribishwa baada ya kuoshwa tunakutana na Kristo tunasema ala kumbe wewe ndiye Kristo na anatukaribisha na hiyo ndio imani yetu na hapo sasa wokovu unakamilika with that now you are safe but at the moment now wakati tuko katika kanisa hili la kuhiji the pilgrim church hatujaokoka bado we are in the journey of getting salvation kabisa salvation wokovu is a process is not like instant coffee unatengeneza tu na koroga na kunywa no kuokoka ni safari na tukishamaliza safari hiyo tukishafika tunaokoka now we are free at the moment tuko wapi tumeongoka hebu rudieni hilo jina tume tumeongoka we are not yet there we are in that journey lakini tumeoshwa dhambi ya asili kwa ubatizo wetu dhambi ya asili imetoka tumeingia katika ukristo ili tufe naye na tufufuke naye James alikufa wakati mzuri sana na ni wakati ningeomba hata sisi tutamani kufa wakati huo wakati tunaingia holy week wiki takatifu tunamalizia kwa resmi Yesu Kristo anaanza safari yake ya mateso na familia ya James iliingia pamoja naye katika mateso hayo na kuubeba msalaba huo na hiyo ndio imani yetu waliingia katika mateso hayo wakati Yesu Kristo katika imani yetu alikuwa kaburini James alikuwa wapi mmoja They were there with Christ alimpokea Let me tell you another one 
unasoma tulisoma seminari mwalimu mmoja akatuambia nataka niwaambie hivi wanafunzi wangu ile wakati mndapokuwa ama tunapokufa wakati tunaingia katika hali ya kifo Yesu Kristo atakuja kwako ama atakuja kwangu akuulize James do you believe that I am Christ the son of the living God atakuuliza and Yesu Kristo is very fair na atauliza kila mmoja kila binadamu ndio unasikia maandiko yanasema hakuna atakayeingia mbinguni bila kupitia wapi kwangu bila kupitia kwangu and Yesu Kristo has got all the fairness than even fair itself is so fair anakuja kuulize Jane scholastica John na Kerali Nyakuni do you believe na kama uamini utaanza kupigana na mawazo hayo unashindwa niseme yes ama ni kwa sababu jamuzoea eh and then you go to the medical terms watakwambia this man was was when he was going through the rigor mortis eh ile akupiga piga ndio that is the conversation that is going on kuna ka dialogue kanaendelea hapo niseme yes ama no na am huyu ni nani i don't know him like kwa bahati nzuri useme tu yes i believe that you are the son of god jesus christ like that thief on the cross alisema aje you are the living god na yesu kristo kamwambia aje leo hii utakuwa na mimi wapi paradise and then ukisema hivyo that wewe ndiye kristo mwana wa mungu Yesu Kristo atasema leo hii utaingia wapi paradiso that's why sometimes naangalia mtu amekufa amelala na anakaa ni kama ana smile because alikubali mape mapema lakini mwingine unaweza ni kama amekasirika kwa sababu hakuwa na alikuwa anashindwa akubali ama afanye nini akatae now who are here na tunaamini na mmesikia mahubiri haya si tuamini leo so that we don't waste time during the time of death na tuombe Mwenyezi Mungu atupe kifo chema we may die well ama kusimura esara yoko kuku ya inasema ngaje by the Asante. Father Morio kiyo sala inakuanga ya kukufa vizuri. Hata mimi uliona nilinyamaza. <laughs> so that we may have a good death. Na huwa inasemwa baada ya kupokea. Ukienda kisi kwa misa unasikia hiyo inasomwa sana. It is a very important prayer ambaye tunaomba kila mtu angefanya nini? Ajue. And every time we go to sleep at night let us tell God that Mungu ukinichukua saa hii nife nikupe kifo che chema. Ndugu zangu, yesterday wakati mlikuwa mnakuja pale nilichukua msalaba na nikaangalia huu msalaba I hope it will be clear. I will leave salab. Again, I want to teach you to teach you. Unaona huu msalaba? Huu msalaba umeandikwa James nyakundi Sunrise 
1st January 1946. Na tumindika hapa Sunrise 2. Sunrise 2. Sia tukulikosea. Yesterday ilikuwa sunset. Na nika ongea na waze. Nika ambia tofadhali. Munezenda mbadilisha ikitu. Na asante ni sana kwa wale ambao walibadilisha. Thank you very much Mr. Kong. Sunrise 2. 26 March 2024. Nakulikuwa na mzee anaitwa Nyaosi hapo tena. Nikamwambia enda ubadilishe utoe sunset uweke nini? Sunrise 2. Why? Sunrise 2 inamaanisha kwamba Mkristo huyu vile tuliambiwa somo la kwanza hajakufa ameingia katika awamu yake ya pili. Amezaliwa tena wapi? Mbinguni. The person who has been baptized a baptized Christian his son or her son never sets ke amata yake ifanye nini i set aizimiki moto wa ubatizo unawaka mpaka uzima wa milele that's why some of the people who write these things are pagans awaelewi kwa pamoja so whenever anytime mnapeleka kwenda kuandika misalaba hii make sure you write sunrise to tusiwaachilie waandike wao wako biashara theologically it is wrong for a baptized person to die kwa sababu gani tunaingia katika kifo cha Kristo na tunafufuka naye te tena asante mba. Thank you very much. That's why tumeandika hivi. Na mnapokuja kanisani na mwili wakati mwingi watu wanawaambia kichwa chake kikae pale. Akae vile alivyokuwa anakaa kanisani. Why? Kwa sababu atafufuka. Afufuke akiwa mkri mahali alikuwa na keti. Fadha Morioki na fadha Nyanga na mimi perhaps if we die. Perhaps eh? You know not that means if we die then if we die eh kichwa chetu kinakaa wapi hapa kwa altari si ndio so that siku ya kufufuka na kufufuka bado tukiwa nini mapadri amen si ndio ndio maana kila wakati nawaambia kichwa cha mkristo kikaa the way we believe na hiyo ndio imani yetu na tusipokuwa na imani hiyo we shall never have hope tumekuja hapa kwa ukoo mmoja We are a people of one faith. Na ukoo wetu si ukabila. Sijakuja hapa kwa sababu mimi ni mkisi. La. Sijakuja hapa kwa sababu mimi ni mkikuyu ama nimeoa familia hii. La. Nimekuja hapa kwa sababu ya ubatizo wetu. Tumebatizwa na maji moja. Na sasa huwa tunasema damu ni nzito kuliko maji. Lakini kwa Ukristo wetu damu si nzito kuliko maji. Maji ya ubatizo ni mazito kuliko nini? Damu. Now we are not related by blood. We are related by water of baptism ambayo imetuleta hapa leo. Ndio umeona jeneza hili lilimwagiliwa nini ma? Maji. Ukifika kaburini tutamwagia maji tuseme kwa maji ulibati batizwa. That's why tunakuondoa ulimwengu huu. Ndugu zangu, imani ni kitu nzuri sana. And let us believe. Nyakundi aliamini mpaka akatupea shamba la kanisa. Mahali tumejenga kanisa. Na kanisa hiyo wakasema aje itaitwa Saint Saint Jacinta ya Nyakundi, si ndio? Eh na tunaomba familia tafadhali msitunyang'anye hiyo shamba. Mtuwezeshe hiyo shamba ikuwe nini ya kani? Vile baba yenu alitaka, si ndio? Eh, tafadhali shetani asiingie mmoja wenu. Si ndio? Akiingia tutamlaani, si ndio? Si hata si tutamlaani, hiyo hewa tu itamlaani tu yenyewe. Hiyo shamba tunaomba lianya kundi iendelee, si ndio? Na ilipeano wa kina Father Morio kiwakiwa hapa. Na wakaibariki. Na kitu ambayo imebarikiwa na kanisa, yoyote anataka kuchukua mkono wake utanini may his right hand with her. Ama both of his hands or her hands maybe <laughs> kwa sababu ya kutaka kuchukua kuchukua kwa sababu alikuwa na imani aliamini 
aliamini kwake kukuwa na nini na kanisa mzee nyakundi alifanya kama vile Musa alivyofanya alikuja hapa akapata mashamba akaanza kuleta kwa watu kutoka kwao ili waweze kufunguka akili tulibarate them awalete awaonyeshe kujeni njooni mtafute mali mali iko hiyo ni roho safi ya Kristo njooni kwetu njooni niwaonyeshe njooni na wewe uko hapa ukienda mali usikue mchoyo ndio sasa nyakundi si amelala hapa kuna mali amebeba na lakini amewacha jina a good name is better than wealth wakati huu ni wakati wa kujiundia jina letu umati huu umekuja kwa nyakundi ni yeye amejizika let us prepare ourselves tenda wema nenda wahindu wanasema hivyo waislamu wanasema hivyo hata sisi wa kristo tunasema hivyo upendo 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 huo umedhihirika leo ndugu zangu tuombe familia hii na familia hii mnapobaki na maisha yenu sisi tunaombea msije mkaleta mambo mambo because of wealth make that wealth your servant not your god pamoja make that wealth your servant but not your god yesu kristo anasema make wealth to make friends even the way politicians wanakujanga kwetu they come they give us gifts they make friends tunawapigia nini mbona mnanyamaza they 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 come with their money they give us they make us friends tunawapea nini kura ama niaje mheshimiwa yes let us make money let us make, let, let us use our wealth to make friends not will bring enmity and especially in a family like this ours is to pray for you na wengine na muombe kama kuna wakati mnatakana kuwa united sana ni wakati huu when the mother has gone and your dad has gone what love what kind of love imeonekana hapa huyu mzee angestahimili that is love according to me huo ni upendo mwi aliona nilikutana naye akaniambia father niko na mali mingi lakini sasa it doesn't make sense to me my wife alienda na mimi naona nikitaenda. Nikamwambia si relax kidogo. Nikamwambia pana mimi ninaona sitakaa sana. Nikamwambia basi ukifika hospitali when you come back ningependa tuwe tukikutana na every evening tupige nini story. Nikakuwa nikipiga naye story kwa simu the other time I'm calling the daughter kapik nyakerari. Akaniambia mzee mahali penye yuko ayuko sawa sana. After some weeks he died kasema sawa tu if Mungu ame accept nivyo let us also nini accept when god does that we accept tusikue wajinga sasa na katika ibada itakatifu ya misa ndugu zangu tumuombe Mungu baba mwenyezi atupe neema neema ya kukuwa watu wema mahali unashiriki be a good person if you are a catholic be a good catholic If you are from SDA be a good SDA seventh day. Si ndio? Usijidai tu wewe ni mkatoliki ama wewe ni mu SDA ama wewe ni full gospel. Utaambia wengine wanaenda half gospel. Ah, that's not the idea. Ishi maisha me mema. As the cry as Christ taught us to be. Ndugu zangu, na hayo ndio maisha yetu. Let make this world a heaven for us. Maisha tuyafurahie vile tulivyopewa na Mwenyezi Mungu. Let us be happy people. Katika hali zetu. Na siku moja tunatumaini tutakutana na nani? Na James. Tumsifu Yesu Kristo.
Ndugu zangu tusimame wote tuweze kumuomba Mwenyezi Mungu kwa ajili ya ndugu zetu waliofariki na kwa ajili ya wote tunaoamini. Muombe Mwenyezi Mungu aliyesema kwamba mimi ni kifo na usukuko aweze kumjalia raha ya mbele dunia yote. Ee Bwana usikie. Mungu apende kumpa huruma ambayo alitarajia kwa kuomba utusikie. Tuombe wote ambao wanahuzunika kwa ajili ya kifo cha James. Mwenyezi Mungu azidi kuwapa nguvu wakati wa majoni. E Mungu utusikie. Na tujiombe sisi wenyewe ambao tu wasafiri hapa duniani kwamba Mwenyezi Mungu atatustawisha katika imani yake. Kwa kuomba utusikie. Naomba waliojiandaa kwa sala za wamu. Tuliombea kanisa e, Mungu Papa tunakuomba Uweze kuchalia kanisa letu mahali popote duniani ili tupate yale yatakao kutuokoa katika maisha yetu ya kiimani ili tukuje kufikia ufalme wa mbinguni saitia mapadri wetu mapisabu wetu na wote makatikista wale wanaenesa nchiri e Mungu sikiliza sara setu Tuombe amani. E Mungu uliye nguvu na kimbilio letu tuko hapa mbele yako tukiombe amani katika familia zetu, kanisa letu na nchi yetu na ulimwengu mzima. Mungu Baba, tunakuomba hasa sana katika nchi yetu ya Kenya. Kuheshimu Mwanaoli heshima neno lako. E Mungu utusikilize. Tuombe familia zetu. E Mungu tuwaje mbele yako. Tuwakushukuru kwa yote mema ambao umetujalia. Tuwakushukuru kwa kuwezesha kuwa na familia ambazo tunatoka. Kwa kuomba uweze kujalia familia zetu ziwe na upendo, familia zetu ziwe na uvumilivu na familia zetu ziweze kuwa familia zinazoika familia takatifu ya Yesu, Maria na Yosefu ambao walikuwa watifu na wanakucha Mungu. Tuomba amani katika familia zetu, tuombea wito katika familia zetu, wote ambao wameitwa katika wito mbalimbali waweze kufanya kazi kulingana na wito. Asa wakati huu mgumu ambapo vijana wanakumbwa na mambo mengi, tuwaleta mikononi mwako uweze kuwaelekeza wazazi hali ya uchumi imekuwa ngumu uweze kutuwezesha kuwatumikia na kuwapa mahitaji yao ya kimsingi yanayowawezesha kuwa watoto wanaomtii Mungu. Tuomba uweze kuondoa magonjwa kati yetu 
wote ambao wamegonjeka waweze kupata adafu na waweze kupona ili waweze kuendelea kusifu na kutukuza siku zote. Tuombea wote wenye nia njema ziweze kutimia katika jina la Kristo tunaomba na kuamini Bwana utusikie wangu usikilize sana. Mwalika ni mwanzo wako wa kaifafa. Mwanzo kule haya oh mwanzo ni mtu wa kaifafa. Mwanzo ni urathime urathime shikoshi yao na hapo urathime kushoke urathime maudu mara moja maki koro mwanzo ni makaria. Rangi mwanzo ni wako wa kaifafa mwanzo ni urathime urathime mara homa yao. Kuna nadhi urathime haya oh mwanzo ni mate. Haya oh mwanzo ni matari mako mwanzo ni mwanzo ni Mwokere hinya no mwokere wetikio mwadhani takowa ya kaifafa mwadhani otoheraria maudu moru mwadhani otohe maudu mega mwadhani na mwadhani otokere hinya Bwana wetu. Ni wakati wa sadaka ya misa na ningeomba wanaume waje hapa watatusaidia kubeba hizi vikapu. Baada ya sadaka ya misa najua familia imejiandaa katika matega tafuata msafara baadaye. Kwa hivyo ningeomba wanaume muje hapa wale ambao mko especially kwa uniform tusaidiane kila mmoja atasimama saidi yake ah, karibuni kwa sadaka
Ningeomba sisi wote tusimame katika msafara wa misa tukiongozwa na familia. Safara wa matenga eh.
haya ndugu zangu tumeingia wakati mwingine awamu ya pili alafu naomba wa Kristo wa Katoliki the ground is so good eh? don't fear kneeling down during consecration especially choir this side sawa sawa tutapiga Salini ndogo ili sadaka yangu na yenu ikubaliwe na Mungu Baba Mwenyezi kwa sifa na utukufu wako na pia kwa mafaa yetu sisi na mafaa Eee Bwana uwera de kuvipokea vipaji vyetu ili huyu mtumishi wako James Nyakundi apokelewe katika utukufu pamoja na mwanao ambaye kwa njia ya sakramenti yake kuu ya upendo wote tunaunganishwa naye anayeishi na kutawala daima na milele Bwana awe nanyi Inuwe ni mioyo Tumshukuru Bwana Mungu wetu Kweli ni vema na haki tendo la kufa na la kuleta wokovu tukushukuru wewe daima na popote e bwana baba uliye mtakatifu kristo bwana wetu yeye ndiye wokovu wa ulimwengu uzima wa wanadamu ufufuko wa wafu kwa njia yake Majeshi ya malaika usujudi ya adama yako wake tunakusehe utujali yetu jiunge nao kwa wimbo wa sifa tukeshereke kusema kwa shangwe
e bwana kweli mtakatifu na kila kiumbe kilichoombwa nawe kinakusifu kwa hapa maana kwa njia mwanao bwana wetu Yesu Kristo na kwa uwezo tendaji wa roho mtakatifu unavitia uzima vitu vyote na kuvitakatifuza wala huachi kukusanya watu kwa ila toka mawe ya jua hata macho yake na bibu safi itolewe kwa jina lake basi tunakusihi kwa kunyenye uvipaji hivi ambavyo tumekutolea ili uvitakase upende kuvitakatifu kwa roho huyo huyo ili viwe mwili na kula akatoa kikombe akashukuru tena akawapa wafuasi wake akisema twaeni mwenye hiki ni kikombe cha damu damu ya agano jipya la milele itakao mwaga kwa ajili yenu na kwa ajili ya wengi kwa mwendele ya damu fanyeni hivi kwa ukumbusho iliyo hai na takatifu tunakuomba uyaangalie mateleo ya kanisa la na kwa kumtambua yeye aliyekafaa ambaye ulitaka kutulizwa kwa sadaka ya kifo chake urjalie sisi tunaotiwa nguvu kwa mwili na damu ya mwanao na kujazwa roho wake mtakatifu tupate kuwa mwili mmoja na roho moja katika Kristo Yeye atufanye sisi tuwe kwako sadaka timilifu na ya milele ili tuweze kupata urithi pamoja na wateule wako kwanza kabisa pamoja na Bika Maria mwenye heri mama wa Mungu takatifu Yosefu mume wa huyo Bika mitume wako wenye heri na mashahidi wako takatifu takatifu James na watakatifu wote ambao tegemea kupata daima msaada wa maombezi yao mbele yao tunakuomba e bwana huyu aliye kafara na upatanisho wetu alete amana wokovu duniani kote upende kuimarisha katika imani na mapendo kanisa lako linalosafiri hapa duniani pamoja na mtumishi wako baba mtakatifu wetu Francisco askofu Cleophas Sesotuka pamoja na maaskofu wote wa klero wote na watu wote unaowafanya kuwa taifa la sikilize kwa wema sala za jamaa hii iliyoko hapa mbele yako e baba ulio mtakatifu kwa huruma yako wakusanye kwako wanao wote wanaotawanyika popote duniani umkumbuke mtumishi wako James Nyakunde Nyarenga pamoja naye pia kumkumbuka Nora Mora Nyakunde
Mie moita kutoka dunia hiyo mjarie kwamba Yeye ambaye alize kesho akifo jamanao kwa upatizo Hari katharika ashiriki ufufuko wake Siku ambayo atafufua huafu katika mili yao e, kutoka rithini e, Siku ambapo hapo e, tu utafananisha mwili wa unyonge wetu na mwili wa utukufu wake pia wapoke e, kwa wema katika ufalme wa ndugu zetu marehemu na wote waliowaga dunia wakiwa wamekupendeza na ase tunatumaini kufika katika ufalme huo ili pamoja e, tusipishwe milele kwa utukufu wako ndipo tutakapofuta utaka kila jozi E katika macho yetu maana kwa kukuona wewe Mungu wetu e kama ulivyo tutafanana nawe milele yote na e, tutakutukuza pila mwisho njia Kristo Bwana wetu ambaye kwa njia yake unaojalia ulimwengu mema yote Wanjia yake na pamoja na na ndani yake wewe Mungu Baba Mwenyezi katika umoja wa Roho Mtakatifu unapata heshima yote na utukufu milele na milele agizo la mokozi wetu na tukifuata mafundisho Mungu tunadhubutu kusema Ufalme wako ufike utakalo ulifanyike duniani kama mbinguni utupelea mkate wetu wa kila siku utusamee makosa yetu kama tunavyosamea na sisi walio tukosea ustutie katika kishawishi E Bwana tunakuomba utuopoe katika maovu yote. Urejelee kwa mamani maishani mwetu kusudi kwa msaada wa huruma yako. Tuopolewe daima na dhambi wala tusifadhaishwe na jambo lolote. Tunapotazamia tumaini lenye heri na ujio wa mokozi wetu Yesu Kristo. E Bwana Yesu Kristo tuambie mitume wako amani na waachieni amani yangu na wapa Usistazame dhambi zetu ila tu imani ya kanisa lako. Upende kulijalia maana umoja kama yalivyo mapenzi yako. Unayeishi na kutawala milele na milele. Halo. Tenena ke tenena tenena. Tusimameni. Hata wakati tuliomba sala ya baba yetu mngesimama woi, nyinyi amuombangi hiyo kweli. Gai gai gai. Haya, sasa ni wakati wa kupeana nini? Amani ya tunapeana amani na tunasalimiana sawa sawa ikiwa uko na adui yako hapa endo umpe amani ikiwa kuna mtu mmekosana si useme kwa mazishi ya nani James ndio tuli si ndio na James akifika jua waombe ama niaje aki usitoke hapa kama umebeba mtu hata kama mlikosana kwa masufuria huko jikoni tafadhali ishia hapa sawa sawa tafadhali tafadhali usitoke hapa kama umembeba inakuwa ni hasara tupu unajiongezea hata attack pressure nini si uitoe leo katika mazishi haya mazuri haya na sasa mpeane na ukiambia ukupea mtu amani unamwangalia kwa uso sura sawa sawa haya na sasa mpeaneni amani ya Kristo
za dunia ili yao walioaliko kwenye karamu ya Bwana sistai vingi lakini sema na roho ya Tumsifu Yesu Kristo. Imefika hadi wakati wa kupokea Ekaristia takatifu na tunawaomba hadi wa Kristo wakatuliki wale ambao wamefunguliwa kupokea Ekaristia na wale ambao wamejitayarisha. Thank you. 
baba cha fadhali msimame Tunasimama kwa heshima ya karistia Wimbo wa shukrani Ya 
Sacramenti ya pasaka Kwa ajili ya mtumishu wako James Nyakundi Nyariega Kwa tunakuomba Umjalie haingie katika makawe ya muanga na amani Kwa njia ya kristu wana wetu Every house there are rules to be followed. So, now, the microphone back to us. So, so, thank you. Uh, praise God Praise God again uh, Kwa majina naitua Cosmas Oboge Nyakundi Mimi ndio kitina mimba wa hii familia And I'll be reading the, <coughs> the story of my dad So dad was born in 1946 in Nyabasere village Miriri sublocation, Gachuba location Masabak sub county, Nyamira county he was a man of remarkable integrity and unwavering dedication. As the ninth child of the late Jeremiah Nyarienga and the late Kemuma Nyarienga and the late Kerbo Nyarienga, 
He embodied the values of love, compassion, and resilience from an early age. His relations were not only in Nyamasebe but also in Metamaiwa, where he was the son-in-law of the late Nemo Lokindo, the late Tabitha Kwamboka, and the late Jeremiah Nyakerario. His education. His journey of learning commenced at Matongo DB in 1958, leading to his CPE examinations at Miriri Primary in 1966. Adulthood beckoned in 1957, where he was initiated into adulthood. The period was also marked by a steadfast commitment to his faith in the Catholic Church, where he was baptized. His work. In 1967, Dad answered the call of duty joining the Kenya police force and embarked on a noble 34-year career that saw him serve diligently across various stations, including Wajir, Garissa, Nairobi, Nakuru, Kapenguria, Kakamega, and Embu. Rising through the ranks, he exemplified excellence culminating in his role as the PCIO Eastern Province until his retirement in 2001 in the rank of the Assistant Commission of Police. Marriage and Family Life <clears throat> So James Union to his beloved the late Nora Mora commenced in 1970 and culminated in a solemnization ceremony in January 1989. The same year marks to be the year which I was born. I was born in October. They solemnized in January. So mdajua mimi ni ule. So this marked the continuation of a love story characterized by devotion, mutual respect, and unwavering support. Together they were blessed with ten children, each a testament to their enduring love and commitment to family. Their children include Regina Nyaboke, the late Joseph Mokaya, Teresia Nyakerario, the late Vincent Nyerienga, Elvin Mokeira, Tabitha Kwamboka, Marcelina Skemunto, Doris Wari, Lillian Kemma, and myself, Cosmas. Dad's expansive heart knew no bounds, fostering connections and relationships that spanned the breadth of the nation. His legacy of love, kindness, and inclusivity extended beyond his immediate family, encompassing siblings, relatives, and friends who cherished his presence and cherished memories shared together. He was the beloved brother of the late Omayo, Wenareri, the late Onyego, the late Nyagitari, the late Isanda, Vosibori, Omenyo, Yovencia, Samuel Okongo, the late Mose, the late John, Mora, the late Teresia, the late Atambo, Edward Okongo, and Misaro. <coughs> Dad was the loving father-in-law of Daniel Munyoki, Evan Soseko, the late Vincent Getuambu, Douglas Keveno, Noel Mweu and Yvonne Schiller. He was also correlated to the late William Mutisia and Agnes Mukiri, Johnson Kiage and the late Esther Bosibori, Mankone Monda and Florence Mwango, Jackson Keveno and Abigail Wonareri, Raphael Mackenzie, the late Ro Rosbesta Mbide and Odilia Mutio, and the late Alex and the late John Rose Morogo and the late Betty Mwendoa. He was the doting grandfather to Patience Mawia, Brenda Mwende, Roland Mora, Emmanuel Mutinda, Anita Bosibori, Wayne Onderi, Joy Mora, Jaden Nyakundi, Vanessa Mora, Nicole Monchari, Abi Mora, Ivan Keveno, Malika Mbide, Kalostin Nyakundi, and Damian Monene Okindo. He also embraced the joy of being a great grandfather to Taj Jabari. He was the brother-in-law to Changamu, Ratemo, Mogaka, Sivia, Late Joyce, Margaret, Stella, Beatrice, Ezekiel, and Ruth, among others. He was an uncle, cousin, and a friend to many. Dad, together with my mom, the late Nora, embraced parenthood with open arms, extending their love and care not only to their biological children, but also to many others who found solace and guidance in their nurturing presence. So <clears throat> among some of the CSR activities dad was involved in, as father was very keen to mention, uh, dad uh, was a very firm believer in religion and the transformative power of religion and the importance that it offers to the people. 
So he recognized part of the challenge that the community was facing in traveling long distances from to St. Peter's Catholic Church. With a generous heart and a vision for community, Dad generously donated land for the construction of St. Jacinta Rianya Kundi Catholic Church in El Bagon. This new branch was established to bring religion closer to the people, ensuring that everyone had convenient access to spiritual guidance. Uh, Father, <laughs> you know we had a discussion, so all of us who are part and parcel, so is your gope, your place of worship is safe. Ah, yeah. So, as the chairman of Oinop Teach Community Water Project, Dad spearheaded initiatives to enhance community welfare. Under his leadership, he initiated the construction of a borehole, ensuring access to clean water for the entire community. Also serving as the chairman of Mwanya El Bagon, Dad dedicated himself to enhancing the lives of community members through social development and empowerment programs. His commitment to social improvement left a lasting impact on the community. Dad also played a pivotal role as the chairman of Minto Members Welfare Association, an organization dedicated to promoting the well-being and empowerment of its members. Through his leadership, the association worked tirelessly to uplift the lives of its members. Hey, is it easy me? Is it mingi? So as the dedicated board member of El Bagon Subcounty Hospital, Dad worked towards enhancing the hospital performance and service delivery. His contributions played a significant role in improving healthcare access and quality within the community. Dad also served with the distinction as the chairman of Kisinya East Africa Limited, where he demonstrated exceptional leadership and business acumen. His guidance contributed to the success and growth of the organization. Dad was also a respected member of the Gusi Council of Elders, where his wisdom and experience were valued as a member. He provided valuable insights and guidance contributing to the preservation of cultural heritage and community cohesion. So his final moments. In the face of adversity, Dad remained a pillar of strength, confronting health challenges with resilience and unwavering faith. Despite his battle with glioblastoma, his spirit remained unbroken, supported by the love and prayers of his family and community. His journey came to a peaceful close on 26th of March, 2024, surrounded by the love of his family. So as we bid farewell to our father, we find solace in the words of 1 Thessalonians 5, 16 to 18, which says, Rejoice always, pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Jesus Christ. May his legacy of love, faith, continue to illuminate in our lives, guiding us through the moments of joy and sorrow alike. Um, I know next we are supposed to read the tributes, but I'm going to request that only the grandchildren come in front and do your one tribute. Our tribute as family members, I believe they're in the booklets you can read. Thank you so much. Grandchildren, Kujeni. Mungu umema atujamaliza misa ningeomba wanasambaza maji tungoje kwanza misa ikiisha tutaendelea misa bado inaendelea Wenye wanasambaza maji achia penye umefika tungoje misa iishe tafadhali Mungu yumwema kila wakati jinangu ni Carlos Tin 
Dearest Grandpa, I feel like the grave has called you too soon. There is an endless void that can't be filled. You are the lamp to my path, the key to my door, the map to the maze called life. I remember every time you came to visit and I told you my scores. You will say, Fanya Bidi, Iliwe Daktari. I know you are with Grandma above the clouds, and I pledge to follow the example you left for us. Though your body is gone, your strong fitting spirit will always be with us. A tribute from Mora Munchari and Kebeno. For us, this was painful to write. Why did you have to leave so soon after Grandma left us? We'll never forget how. Oh. We'll never forget how you encouraged us to work hard in school and become the doctors you wanted us to be. We're truly grateful for your presence in our lives. Even though we never got to see you most of the time, we'll cherish the, the little moments we spent together. We believe we'll never find anyone to fill the gap that you left. You truly were special, and for that, we'll miss you a lot. Heaven must be happier with you and grandmother. May you continue watching over us till we meet again. My name is Imanul Mutinda. Dear grand. Dear Grandpa, I still can't believe that you are gone. The news of your passing broke my heart. I know your soul is in heaven, dancing with the angels watching over us. You are my real model. I'm grateful to have learned the values of integrity, love and peace from you. Your teachings will guide me through difficult and challenging times. You are physically gone, but your spirit lives forever. Rest in peace, my hero. My name is Joy Mora. I hold the dear memory of my beloved grandfather, whose caring presence illuminated my life. He was more than a patriarch to me. He was my guiding light, a source of unwavering love and strength. His warmth enveloped me. His, warm, his wisdom shaped my path and kindness touched my soul deeply. In his gentle embrace, I found solace in his laughter pure joy and his words, profound wisdom that continues to resonate within me. Though he is departed, his legacy of love and compassion lives on forever in my heart, a constant source of inspiration and comfort. Amanito Seko, Sokoro, you are more than just a grandfather to me. You are a guiding light, a source of unwavering support and a wellspring of wisdom. Your kindness knew no bonds, and your strength was a pillar that held our family together through thick and thin. Even though you are no longer with us in person, your spirit remains ever-present, guiding me in my daily life and reminding me of the values you instilled in me. I cherish the moments we shared and the lessons you, thought, you taught me. Thank you for being such an incredible influence in my life. I miss you every day, Grandpa, and I will always carry your love with me. I am Wayne, and I'm going to read my tribute. In the tapestry of my life, there exists a cherished thread woven by the hands of my caring grandfather. His presence was a beacon of light, casting warmth and understanding upon my journey. Beyond the titles of kinship, he was a compassionate soul whose love knew no bonds. His tender care nurtured me. His gentle guidance steered me through life's twists and turns. And his unwavering support lifted me to new heights. His legacy is not just a memory, but a living tes testament to the power of love and kindness. Though he may have been farewell to this earthly realm, his spirit continues to inspire me. A timeless reminder of the profound impact of his love. Um, I'm Vanessa. 
Dear Sokoro, you leaving us has been a soul to the injury of Baba's passing. You've always been there for me, taking me to school, celebrating my small and large academy. So I will help her read. Dear Sokoro, you leaving us has been a soul to the injury of Baba's passing. You've always been there for me, taken me to school, celebrated my small and large academic wins. From you, I've learned the values of determination and to always strive to be the best in everything that I do. I will surely miss your laughter, for you are no longer here to share it with us, your grandchildren. But in everything I do, I always think of how proud you are of me from heaven. I will forever remember the nickname for me, Kadogo. I would have loved for you to stay longer with us here, but God had other plans for you. The sun shines a little less without you in our home, but we'll be sure to carry your legacy with us. We'll always miss you, Kadogo. My name is Roland Mara. Dear Sokoro, you left without saying goodbye. In my heart, you hold a place that no one else will ever feel. It breaks my heart to lose you, but you never went alone for a part of me went with you. I thank God for giving me the best grandfather. I will dearly miss you, Sokoro. You will forever be my hero. I hope Baba has received you well. Say hi to her for me and tell her that you miss her so bad. This is not goodbye, but I'll see you soon. With love. <laughs> Good afternoon, my name is Brenda Munyoki. I'll read my grandfather's tribute. Oh, this is hard. Dear Sokoro, it is hard that this message gets you while you are watching over us in heaven. But one thing I'm happy about is that you will give you your flowers when you are alive. Many are the good things you did to me. From being present in all my milestones to scolding with lots of love, especially when asking for my grades, and God knows I have never been number one. So you would ask, your class yenu kulikuwa na mtu alikuwa number one kweli. You are a mentor, a provider, a leader, and above all, a preacher. Since you still the value of being staunch Christians and always emphasized on the importance of being rooted to church. You are close to me more than a friend because we would always talk and laugh quite often. I remember you would ask me if my mom, aunt and uncle know that you deserve more monthly allowance after the dominated PA, mind you, they kept on changing time to time, failed to perform their job. At least I'm one of the grandkids who has never been called Mjuaji. Grandpa, you always wanted the best for me. You are a man of valor, very resp respectable, and above all, my mentor. You kept on asking us to release you because you wanted to rest, but you kept on telling you the time is not right. Today I release you. So my heart aches. I let you rest, Grandpa. I thank God for giving me you because you are such a charming and lovely grandfather. Any person will ask for. So, Koro, I hope that you are happy and free from pain. I hope that Shosho will come to you in heaven and that you two have reunited and are happy. Please say hi to Shosho and tell her that we miss her dearly. Go be well, my Sokoro, and my young man. It shall be well with profound love when they are sick and grandchild. <laughs> hi, everyone. Uh, young man, they say the greatest love you'll experience in life is that of a grandparent. And truly, you loved us so much. We thank God for the time we spent with you and for the memories that you will live to cherish. I always called you young man and you will always say, Mimi Nimze, 
hata nikienda saisi ni sawa si hata Raila amenishinda na mwaka mmoja then we will have a hearty laugh we always tell you that you are still very young and energetic and you still had a long way to go we accept God's will for you fought so hard Sokoro you are the strongest man we know and we release you to rest in God's embrace you've taught us to love selflessly care for people and help them without expecting anything in return kindness hard work and respect for all without discrimination so Korea will leave behind a legacy so great so 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 great it's beyond measure we shall carry on with so much pride because we learn from the best when you told Taj you've gone to heaven he prayed for you <clears throat> to get to heaven safe and I hope you have how is it reuniting with your love must have been one happy reunion also I love to Vava please let her know we still think about her and we dearly miss her <laughs> I hope in the next life I'll get to keep my job permanently. Being a PA that is like initially kuchelewa kuitisha allowance kitu ya kuvuta mtu kweli. You are the best Sokoro and we'll always brag about you. Rest in love Sokoro, first grandchild we are. If you give a little more. <clears throat> uh, so finally as the last thing that we are going to read as most of you know my dad was a man of many words and he had quite a lot of uh, for lack of a better word famous punchlines alikuwa anatumianga when he wants to interact with people so diana is going to read for us some of these punchlines i'm sorry they in kkc some of you today will have to be linguist look for a neighbor who's a kissy around you to give you translations thank you Okay we are going to start with Mokorara buna bakungu ba abaindi Nko wetera bune turakta abantu bakagere ne imeja accident Ningante te abantu babwate intelligence Eskuru eye ino namba ya motarengo Omwana oyu orenge namba eye mo naki nki eki akori sobo ngogorere mokora yeramba ka chinda cha baliride tebya omwana oyu oteneine mogondo enyoni ngokagerere no mote emogwere as we love you him but you have no choice no sibigwa obonga ini nege kombe to kongainia iyo ni maendeleo ekere mwa mwa ekere mwa ku mo kwa mwa ondeta yo orenge omongaini ah thank you so much everybody i uh, will hand the microphone back to the church <laughs> mababa wote wa kizina ga they have those punch lines eh my father used to tell me one word to a wise man is enough and he could talk for two hours ndio nielewe hata mimi tumsifu Yesu Kristo asante you grand kids uh, for those moving tributes eh? thank you very much now mheshimiwa karibu kuja nikwambie kitu hebu <laughs> tupigie mheshimiwa makofi huyu jamaa kama unataka na kuruhes unajua kazi yeye amefanya huko hata mimi natoka huko na mengine atawaambia Simpie mzee makofi wewe unamjua vizuri. Wale watu wamesaidiwa na huyu jamaa wanajua. Mheshimiwa karibu. Ginata kokore. Asante sana father na na wasalimu kwa jina la Yesu wa Mzambo ni salamie tu hata kama tuko hapa asante sana kwa familia ya ndugu yangu mzee wangu bwana Nyakundi nataka kusema pole sana huyo mzee amerara hapa tumechuana kwa mtamrefu sana 
nilimjua nikikuwa Nairobi nikifanya kazi huko alikuwa mkubwa ya pale mahali anaitwa Nasroeli kwa hivyo fata tumepoteza mtu ya maana sana bila kumesikia fata amesema mimi naitwa Nalepa ni ni mbaya si mimi so it's not <laughs> the mtu anaweka hiyo anasema mimi ndio nimekaa mbaya umenisikia sasa okay asante bila kumesikia mimi naitwa mheshimiwa hivi vile vile mmesikia mimi naitwa mheshimiwa Samuel Yarama ni member of parliament kutoka na Akuru Town West Constituency lakini kwetu ni kisi huko Nyamira kwa watu wa Nyamira wamefika wame kutoka mahali Nyakudi ametoka niona kwa mkono watu wa Nyamira kidogo okay ndio tena mwanga bange sana sasa naonekana eh, wale kama huko karibu na mwenzako na wewe usikiki kisi utaongea utafanya eh, translation lakini bila mmesikia hii mzee anaitwa Nyakundi nimemjua kwa muda mrefu sana yeye tulikutana na yeye Nairobi akikuwa mkubwa ya CID akikuwa DC ya yo industrial area ndio nilimjua baadaye nikakuja kufanya kazi na Akuru nikakuwa tumekutana na Akuru pia akikuwa deputy PC ya yo na tukaendelea kusaidiana sana ila kitu najua kuhusu hii mzee ni kwamba alikuwa mkarimu sana na sasa ile nimekuja hapa leo nimekuta marafiki wengi wamenibia simu wakaniambia na kuja hapa mmoja wa wale wamenibia simu na amenipea pesa yake shilingi elfu kumi nileta hapa ni solicitor general wa nchi yetu ya Kenya na alikuwa mheshimiwa kutoka mahali msa ametoka anaitwa solicitor general anaitwa mheshimiwa Moses sijui kama mnamjua watu kutoka kitutu chache kitutu masaba mnamjua Mwe simu ino rokoro kwa Mose. Na ere ontomagoja na ndo ngede tiba sa tia chiringiri bu komi ndetere familia to kora ni mbaregari. Oyo ndo ontomire gocha iwa koro kwa misati. Na ere no arwe tena ere sa ino na ero ngede tiri wisano no ndi wate ga ngore tano. Na tata kusema ivi i kifo eh kwa i muchi ni miona si mara ya kwanza. Sometime pack just a few i think it's almost one week ago mi najua bwana nyaosi alipoteza mke wake na yeye tukamshika pale kitengera lakini si kuenda lakini tuliwasiliana na yeye hamna kumbuka mke wa huyu jamaa rafiki yetu bwana nyakundi aliaga sometime park na tukamshika hapa immediately after yule mwingine alikuwa anaitwa mumani ameaga mimi nataka tuweke familia kwa maombi kwa sababu saa zingine kuitu usinifanyika kwa muji hata unashangaa ni kwa nini you can imagine that time the wife passed on just around one year ago msa amirara leo lakini bibirie nasema atuwezi kuulisa mazuri that's what I see nasema yu na mire meno umeupiri hapa mzuri sana uyu ameupiri hapa is my relative uyu 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 sikuwa na mejua I would never attend that where you are preaching in a place like this amwapi hapa <laughs> unajua sasa hivi nilikuwa nakuja nilicherewa kidogo sikuwa nimeona ni wewe sasa hivi nimekaa pale ndio nimeambia wale majamaa nikasema eh hey, huyu father is my relative kwa hivyo eh nimefurahia bila na upiri na sasa mimi nimeona sasa nitakuita kila wakati tuwe tunaongea vile tunaongea kila wakati ndio nifundisha hata mimi at least nijue si mbaya kujua maneno ya bibilia sana si nyinyi wote ni wa kristo mwezi mmoja wa kristo iyo wana dera wa istu aikire ti amba tabie aba getutu na mwa tori ni mweka si ni peke ya mmepotesa rafiki ama si watoto wake wamepotesa papa yao this is just like our father to one of us oyo no mondo obuwa ten korengi ya sana i remember sometime back e kada ritarete ara jago jaga e watu arkuma na nene na mumani yes you used to come even to my own home na ndio am even thinking that at one time wakati nimeomba kura hapa since 2013 hii mzee alikuwa ametoa watu hapa atakujuka kukuchukua kura huko na kuta na wesi wa nipie because he was my good friend kwa hiyo yeye amejangia kwa maneno kubwa sana kuanga kuwa mheshimiwa pale kuanzia 2013 mpaka saa hii because I've been a member of parliament since 2013 2017 and 2022 
na iko kitu nataka kuambia watu ya Reparo kama muka hapa na mimi nataka niongee na kitu afikie serikali ya kwamba iko watu wameanza kuingia kwa mashamba ya watu ati kwa sababu hiyo watu wanatoka sehemu fulani ya hii nchi sikio kama watu ya Reparo ni wakisi mmesikia hiyo maneno let me tell you here today wale watu wanadanganya nini ati wako na rais ati president kwa sababu ametoka sehemu yao mimi nasikia wa Karenji ni kutoka bande hii wameanza kuingia kwa mashamba ya wakisi ati wanaenda kutaka kuenda kulima hapo na kuanza kuchenga ati kwa sababu president ametoka sehemu yao the president is not aware mtu asiwatanganye na mimi nikikuwa mjumbe jura anashirikiana na serikali chusi wase wengine wamekuja mpaka pale nikawatuma wakaenda kwa account commissioner mimi mwenyewe tutakuja na account commissioner hapa ni atia mbobe sana mtu kuenda kuingia kwa samba ya mtu ati kwa sababu president ya metoka kwa hiyo sehemu ya wakare njini that is not what the president is saying in this republic fata nataka mu, muende muupirie watu wa wate manana ya ukabira wili ya muruto ni president ya wakenya kuwati Akuwa akui president ya watu wa jaji ndio wengine wanaanza kuingia kwa mashamba ya wengine kuanza kulima hapo na kuchanga manyumba. Hata sasa ile wanafanya hiyo kazi sijui wanakuta watu wa serikali wako wapi. Hii serikali inakuwa na, sere, na watu ya serikali pande kweli. You know nyakundu huyu ameaga alikuwa na samba na akaniereza akaniambia samba yake pia watu walikuwa nataka kuenda kuingilia ndio waanze kuinyakuwa kusema ati kwa sababu wametoka kwa sehemu fulani. Sisi wote ni wa Kenya. We are here by right. Adwes kukubali. Nimeambia county commissioner akuja hapo from next week. Nimeongea na mkubwa wa security bwana Kindiki. Nikamweleza nikamwambia iko shida ya Bagoni na Moro. Kwa hivyo kama shamba yake imeingiliwa tafadhali okuje ndio tukusaidie so that ndio upate shamba yako. Ini kidudu ni kama iko watu wanataka kuchukua shamba ya Musa Mirara hapa. Kwa sababu hiyo ni kitu nione imeanza sana. Sawa ndio mwangusi na nareba ta yabu mwako nyakundi no mundu muyo renge na enda ari geta banta bange sana mwako mu jani morora oliyo rekoro go tanga ndeko kenda mumanyi na ndetine ro muri geta na bande na arira bande ya yo mwaka na ndeba ari na ro go go boja tima dio boja no ba bara ko moti mo na yo boja tena nga bande bakora re ori oria oya go go boja no muskari go bere na aritaya na ro muskari go tare ore sinya Oye na romo promo de dia jiko basini. Te dia romo promo de dimo anga. Iko ta oye no munyari bari. Ta bwa de mangano boka bira ko buna nga yuru de mane ko okone. Rati tiga to bwa tana mo sa bere family ye. E ga ko bera mo ako de bono rari de. Nje bwe ko munyene na agenda pakka mo ayi nyu mba kitengera. Ta sa menyete. Dina di sa da dina mo ranga yi anda ko no bisanda. Mo ako yi sanda de mane na ko mo Nero magrete si mi alante na mo ako ribo ri na ruarete a ribo ri na ruare ki tengara pa tila ki ri na ri na ji no meta na ga ki tengara ko ni wana ki na ni omba a drove myself from my house baka mo a ye a sa me nya tenga ji nga nyoro mo muro ye o mo muro ye o buo ye o yo ga to a kuana ko mo ka ni wana ri ve a wo si a ba a ba a ba swa ti ba mo mbara ba ngi na ba ve ri ti ma ti fa ri ti no ba ri ngi nga ni wana ri u sa mo a ba na ba a ri ti ni aro ngaikara <laughs> No otro como bro yo ya no na ne casi ne ya mu mu ngwa no ri mu abu mu man bono oko manya bo njo ka ya to kwa na komu ko abu ni ji ba ka ngere sa ya onjo bete na re de ya onjo ka ku te other side you could not talk the after bono ka komu ka ro to ka re na go to ka ande sitting ku mu to ka ansa to ka ma na ro mu ka ba te ri mu ka ngere sa nka ba te mu bu ri mu ri ya ka ta ri e wa ko ba te ko ra ga ra ga ji ko be ku mu bi re ri u ta ko chia so it was like ni adu the throne yani kwa nini kila sasa toka na eh arudi na tabu at life na leo na abana wa tabanga grace ni bwana ndevia 
ba muri nyaga tari ngaba bavya atgon tunakuru ba bavya tuwa bari pak tuna Nairobi ngama gumu kama bia i was going to Nairobi go kora something else ngaba wa ngi morore ngena jiko morora ga kan ta zo tuna na ba tie moa ko ri san ba kini ya dana ikira ari giri giri ngarora esimi eh ya isabo go nga kera nga kumi na ki bono ata mukono ma bi go hina bo de ma bi six Entera ganga nego gano mwa guru se na ngi kumwa dala na tenu mwa guru yuzi de saku kama ago sabe si mi yo mwa no yo mwa na ngamwa dala na tenu mwa no usiri de aba na tenu mwa dala na ku ba ti e fa mi po de san ama guri na ba de ko rukana ba ba no sometimes ya ngi na ngi ba ba ipo de ano in you at omo ranga de na wo ti guli ngi ki aga ten ki uski aga ten de wono wo jaga ba ki nya mwa no uspi nya sa ago korak Nero kwa ngalani ndo kumuvu na fata urani ribi ya sana abao tio kwa na wengine juu ya dabe fata tatu mwa wana asira nuko nuko kwa nero ni yama kuele na baadhi ya kiro mwongo tuto ribi ya tuwa sawele na sana na ba kwenye kimoja au rara ano you are responsible people wata la kuhusu tatu mina tigeire moja dereva tio romo chama moja dereva uskie bintu bintu na tuto dereva tuwe sinto bwa tia wa ibodi na wao asire tena jere kwa jere ma ma tapa son My father passed on. I was even very young that time. In Kairuna, I remember that we went to Sabaiiri. I think I am a member of Parliament now. When my father got arrested, he was telling my mother, "Said that I am going to move to Nissan." I am going to go to Nissan. 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 Rajin tu bos abelnya family ye. Tiada tu bos abelnya nenek nenek nanti apa? Apa nak usir abelnya itu pada apa aja? Asal tu usir. Baliya abang jemaat tu abel tu kau bawa dengan bondo jadi no. Orang yang kau buat teri teri aho, aho tak bondi, aho tak nak kuru tu aja nak dengan tu aku mana ni minister for tanah or security. Kau tu tu korang mau kuda mau apa? Nanti bila member parliament tu buat dia ye. Orang tu buat si usir dia mau orang tu buat mau tak boleh mau rosak rosak apa dah tinjau apa? Kau kau buat tu. Aí o que era, vai ser o meu governo de presidente a ter. O presidente tu vamos ter três e não ninguém vai mudar o resto. Is you are right. Agora a gente não está a ver a gente não está a ver a gente não está a ver o mundo. Tu vai tirar o dedo. É por a ver o que vai ganhar o dinheiro na hora na hora do. Uma vez esse é o dia presidente é a rumo os dias. Uma vez não vai acabar vai ser o meu governo a ver o meu dinheiro. O meu governo não é o meu governo. O meu dinheiro é só o aí tu. Tu vas pas amener mon monde, mais quand il a écrit le livre, il a dit qu'il n'y a pas de Brésil. Il a dit qu'il n'y a pas de Brésil. Il a dit qu'il n'y a pas de communauté. Il a dit qu'il n'y a pas de Brésil. Il a dit qu'il n'y a pas de Brésil. Le problème, il a dit qu'il n'y a pas de Brésil. Il n'y a pas de Brésil. Il n'y a pas de Brésil. Je ne sais pas si il n'y a pas de Brésil. 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 Il n'y a pas Weta you for the default government or not? If you want to be rich, you gotta. You have to have a lot of money. Do I have to be poor? You don't have to go to the bank. You have to have a lot of money. I'm hundred percent sure as I talk here today that the president of this republic of Kenya has entertained that nonsense. Whereas I'm convinced that this is now where the people yet they are so resistant to the other communities. You have to make no more and that. Now they stop all and that. You have to have a lot of money. 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 You are right. O rapaz que começou a atacar te, hoje ele ajudou o rapaz, ele agora abriu a boca e me avançou, ele vai cobrar tanto o mandato quanto o valor, ele me convida a ir. E que nem então mais depois ele agora ainda coco a na guti, autoridade, ele agora abandona o mandato para ir levar até ele. Abandona o mandato agora na moro tu ainda não ele não morega, moro você não anda, abandona o dico o rei não morre aí não, mas é saudí, o mundo com a mão no ar, o país vai ter que ser mais diante de tudo, vai ter que ir tap. Iwo na wuto kwa ndako yangu ndani kwa iwo tuwa tena wakati mgeni tewe baadhi 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 kose moho tena na esimu re ya baadhi baadhi tuwa tena bara bu baadhi kose moho tena na abu wa mo mo ego la jinsi ya hivyo mkuu ania mkuu ania baadhi baadhi tuwa tena bara bu abadhi na baadhi iri baadhi no na mo 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 wana ni ni kundi tewe 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 kundi tewe sawa baadhi baadhi kwa tewe mtoa na ya robi na sini njio Abadi kwa watu mwa rafu njoo dada yamu pe wengine mwa watu mwa tu tu mwa tu mwa tu mwa mwa mto yamu grango radio dosiye kwa risiko na ndo mwa mto tu na rosi la njoo kwa na rieta kasi rana tu wao njoo kwa na kasi rana wao karibu tu maadhi tajika tu wao tayari wao tayari shuru yeti 
eh santu mheshimi wa ram na nche kwa ila nilie familia ya kundi at large bole sana jesa maria tangoro kwa makana robinas goro kitutu masaba yesima ward lakini ya kundi akuru gachuba ward na nche na atavile pole ni mbu ate rambi rambi yane tete kwa baya 3000 na father ni remu ya 2000 na aru wa very wonderful samu asanti samu Thank you so much. Ora fa taga di mo tiru ari mo ro ambi yamana nyakundi. Awa ntwa ya sa na bwan bi mo re mwens. Asa mo rieta Felix yakundi. Enka ya neri kobe. Angana manga. Asa family ya nyarianga. Paul and Sana. We are family close friends. Paul. Asante. Asante mwesmiwa Kwa familia ya msenya kundi Paul San Kwa antuwa minto mwa kwenye kundi Ekela alivo kolega asima Na buwa bantuwa agerete nga hake ruchikura Ngelijo mbusiyo mutanga ni wake ruchikura na akuru Ase mjituwa wata bantuwa ito bato lendete Wano nungu ichi anoko nene Kuna mwezimu wa kuwa nireva, wanyo hundi, ukale kuhiru hundi kiara, kuhira, tochamo, tokonyane. Magana manene, tusabili ya familia ya nyakundi, avana wa ena vachukuru. Nyasawa vaziseni. Mbuya mwono, situi kama tuko na watu kutoka hapa wa anybody, kutoka provincia administration, tuko na chief ama assistant chief, Naro ronyo ni nakuwa rusi Hata kama umetoka kisi Kuja hapo kujo salamiyane Kama umetoka kisi Ama mari yoyote Kuja hapo kujo salamiyane Taka moja karibu mchifu Mbija mwono karibu Nga hiyo duweta wana Miriri Mwaya soo wabu mga ambioke Mbija mwono mwesi miwa siri baga Hama kwa ni mwesi wa hiri Nasa eno miyatu anjiri Toka ni mwesi miwa nyakundira ero Samarita njengoro kuhiricha, nyaenya Ndo mwesimi assistant chief, miriri Miriri na wawo mwesimi wawo yetu nya masewe Na hende igare yanko yane Nwanda atewa asoyo minto Aminto renchina Baba Teresa Mwesike kosma asina alo kogo hile nyimbo Nika wano ndo cha mangana ya wena hile Tika toba amu Nyo mwana aso wantega ya Kwa nero bagwe na badi zonyo Mbiya mura haba kusiba Niba minto mua rukuru kusi Tuwacha kwele raga iga Nche sama rita nkuru kibaga hindi Fred Iwendo muasista nchifu Gali utawala Miyango Haba nito baliba utawala Ntuwacha ni mbogi iga iga Mbogi ili utawala kwa utelena Tiche ya manichirichi yonsi baba mgoya Babu nyangwe so kwa ni haba anto Bia mwono bia mwono haba anto bali tuwaru na arobi Ya saba seseni na ande kari moko irana Mwira nema mwarembe Ya se family ya saba seseni gaki Pole se laki ya mwoke ndu Bia mwono Amjambo wa mbeleza juwate Mimi ni assistant chief semui ya ndoswa Inaitua kapcholola Ningependa kusema pole kwa familia Kwa kumpoteza baba Rafiki Kazi Mzee alikuwa mtu mzuri sana Mzee ambaye mituletea maendeleo Hapa vile mmesoma kwa hile kitabu Na alikuwa rafiki yangu sana Sababu Hamitembeza mpaka kwa ke kule kitengela Pia hamitembeza mpaka kwa ke kule kisi Na pia asha kuja mpaka kwangu Kwa hivyo alikuwa rafiki wakaribu sana Na ni pole sana Ningependa tu kukuzia yale mwishimua Rama amesema Kuhusu yao watu ambao labda walifanya makosa kuenda kujenga jeka nyumba kwa mashamba ya wenyewe Iyo ni mamba ambao tayari tusha isimamisha DC ya likuja na amesimamisha yu maneno Kwa hivyo hata kama county commission atafika Pia ni vizuri sabu pia tusha sikia kwamba atafika Tunashukuru sana sababu 
hiyo uh, maneno isha simamishwa hakuna ujenzi inaendelea na tunaomba county commissioner na pia akifika aendelee kusimamisha hiyo maneno asante sana hapa tukaribu unajua kama wewe ni chiu ya area hii my brother don't allow muskubali mtu hata kuingia i don't even know why you want uh, uh, dc akuje na wewe huko hapa don't allow people to build on people's unajua hilo ndio kuharibia president jina hata sisi wenyewe tulipigia president kura so ukikuta wakati jina wanaanza kumwambia watu ati tunataka kwenda kujenga kwa sababu president president does not belong to one community that one we are coming there enda kamata watu peleka watu kotini hiyo watu watoke kwa mashamba ya wenyewe si hiyo itakuwa mzuri ndugu yangu wewe unafanya kazi mzuri na kushukuru sana unione kando tuongee mimi na wewe ni mtu mzuri pas <coughs> Eh, familia eh, wageni ya mchambo wote ya mchambo tena eh, kwa machina ninaitwa senior chief chana komen mimi chief wa ndoswa eh, leo mimi sina mambo mengi ni kusema tufole kwa mzee James James ame tumefanya kazi na yeye kabla hata akiwa na guru tulikuwa na yeye ngiwa persons na mimi ni chief wake upande wa ndoswa ametuletea maendeleo sana ondopo tat tuko tuko kanisa moja ninasema pole sana kwa biblia uleni sana tuko pamoja eh iko maneno assistant chief amesema mheshimiwa we are neighboring that location lakini mambo imetulia serikali wamefanya kazi watu walipelekwa kotini ya hapa ni Kenya na kila mtu wako na haki kuishi mahali popote. So hiyo mheshimiwa hiyo imeshughulikiwa na serikali. Tumeshughulikia. Asante ni. Wageni mpige nyumbani salama salami. Asante. Asante sana chief. Chief eh asante sana. Eh mheshimiwa asante kunipatia nafasi. Mimi kwa majina naitwa Christopher Isoe. Eh, kwangu ni hapa na kurungata lakini natoka kule nyumbani kisii sehemu ya Nyarivadi masaba nimekuja kusema pole kwa familia ya mwenzangu James Nyakundi Nyakundi tulifanya kasi naye kwa muda mrefu sana tulikuwa na kaa naye Nairobi kwa sehemu sote katika Kenya Nilishangaa sana juzi kuona kwa gazeti siku nimejua kama James ndikuwa mgonjwa nilisoma gazeti kwamba James amelala nikausunika sana na nikaambia mama wa kwangu leo lazima niende masisi ya James nimetoka nakuru asubuhi siku anasikia vizuri lakini nikasema lazima nifike niseme pole kwa watoto wa rafiki yangu James ambaye amelala pole ni watoto wachukuu wote dunia ni hivyo vile imesemekana na tumepata neno la Mungu mambo ya dunia hii hii ndio njia tu hakuna njia nyingine ni kukubali vile imetendeka imetendeka na tukubali James ameenda na wengine wako nyuma wanakuja sisi ndio tutaenda pale ameenda poleni na wale wametoka kisimu rudi salama Mungu apeleke salamu ufike vizuri tu siti kuombeana kila wakati Asante sana. Mwako yeye kwa na akoro kuiso eh. Iso alikuwa mkubwa pia ya police at what the same level na huyu ndugu yetu hapa. Tusiwaje watu wengine ije. Iko watu walifanya kazi pengine na mzee wako hapa. Any senior officer who worked with the late unaweza kuja hapa. Kuja tu onekane si mbaya. Kwa sababu unajua wengi wametoka mbali. Iko hata mmoja tumewaja nje akuje. Hakuna Eh? Even serving even those serving um, I mean we know wanajua hata those who are who are serving who are seen is under hata kama wewe I know is you uh, is you are God your cousin you can come and say yeah maybe most likely ndio alikuwa alikuwa chiri kasi salamiana tu I know you it is one of the family members mzee huyu alikuwa rafiki hata kama ni rafiki yangu lakini alikuwa pia relative wa karibu sana na huyu wacha ongeza dakika moja baadhi ya sources sabi ama you retired no sana <laughs> <laughs> na mimi nasema asante sana kwa kucha kutupa pole 
pamoja na hii familia ni ingependa kurecognize officers wote wale ambaye bado wanasafu katika hiki kitengo cha National Police Service pala marehemu alikuwa anafanya kama wako hapa pala popote walipo wanaweza simama tafadhali nami naitwa Peter Isanda huyu ni yanko yangu na pia nimelete salamu za rambi rambi kutoka kwa aliyekuwa DCI DCI Francis Sang angekuwa hapa lakini amesema pole pamoja na County Police Commissioner Nigori pia walifanya na yeye pia amesema pole thank you very much uh, kwa machine anaitwa Edward Mwamba tena niongea hapo Kimbereni au uh, nyakundi tumefanya kazi na yeye tuliandiku pamoja tukalitaya pamoja na hiyo rangi wengine tukabaki hapo hapo kwa hivyo ni rafiki ya ndani sana waja Mungu aweke mema Asante habari zenu Jina yangu naitwa ndani ya Motesia kutoka kaunti ya Kitui e, mahali naitwa location ya Sekuru e, Mheshimiwa tafadhali kwa heshima yako kuna kuna wakubwa wale wengine ya uh, administration nilikuwa umeweta hapa lakini na, na ndogo sewa ya kwamba chivu ya kwetu kwangu nyumbani amewasili hapa kabla sijasema na wengine na kuomba kwa heshima chivu ya kwetu Saikuru Kaiviria madam chief tafadhali ningekuomba ukoje usalimie okay asante mheshimiwa ukiendelea okay, kukuja kama bado huko hapa mimi nafikiri mimi ndio kijana mkubwa kwa mzee Nyakundi oh mimi nifika kwa hii mboma 1993 na mimi ndio bwana ya Regina um, nafikiri hapa tu tumekuwa kwa hii muji kutoka kisi kutoka hapa mpaka okay. asante kwa sababu labda sijui kama atapata na bazi zingine yangu ni mawili matatu ya kwanza ni kwa, kwa, kusema pole kwa hiyo ama da ya mzee eh, nyakundi na watu yake yote na marafiki yake mheshimiwa akiweko anasema polen sana ya pili ni kwa ndugu wale tumekuwa kwa hii mboma nafikiri ni mimi ni mtangulizi ningewaomba ile ushirikiano tumekuwa nayo tukae na huo ushirikiano ya tatu ningeomba watu wenye tumekuwa hapa kwa hii masishi kwa hii nene eh, ya my, 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 my parents yeah. 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 ningeomba na ninyi ile ushuru mlikuwa mnasema nayo mwewe kuhusu hiyo mzee msibaki hiyo tunaona sisi kama watoto and then tukitoka tu mwanza kuwa sasa ninyi ndio mnachokosa hiyo mboma tunza yale unasema tunza yale unafanya kwa hiyo mboma asante sana kwa hiyo ndio chini asante sana chief dakika moja tu tutambulishe ndio tutokea tumalisia hapo karibu dakika moja tunaacha asante kwa nafasi kwanza nitashukuru Mungu kwa kutembea eneo hili kama vile mmesikia mimi ndiye chifu wa area Munyoke ametoka na Regina. Hata nilikuwa nimekuja na watu wa kwangu tukuje tulie na hii familia. Sijui kama watapata nafasi wa kuja hapa hata waone. Watu wa Tikuru kaiviri ya kujeni muonekane hapa. Ama mahari hivi tu. Aya tumeshukuru sana hata sisi. Eh yangu ile nitasema nimeona huyu mzee mlikuwa mnampenda sana. Kwa hivyo hiyo upendo udumu asadeni. Asante sana chifu. Nasikia iko Eh sijajeza sijasema si jina langu. Jina langu naitwa Christine Kiabikelonzi. Asante. Wamekujua wa unajua kitikia chifu wanajua chini imefika iko watu wametoka nafikiria hospitali ya Nyamira is you watu wale wamekuja maybe you can uh, appreciate them and maybe you can talk on behalf of them let me take them oh you take them through yeah. okay waje mimi nimalisia hapo watu wa Nyamira mwongo wa namoya ndugu ya ya mwana tuganya saba kwanza thank you so much mungu awabariki mkifika mfike salama thank you asante sana mheshimiwa arama tunashukuru sana Um, 
vile nilikuwa na utangulizi hapo mbeleni niliwambia kwa majina naitwa James Gichana mwiberania kutoka EGSFM mshimi wa rama tumefanya kazi na yeye kwa Alright thank you so much sasa nafasi hii nimepatiwa um, ili iliongoza kutoka mbeleni kabla tuingie kwa kanisa sasa nataka nitambui familia kwa sababu familia wako hapa na wajapata nafasi watasimama tu wakipewa picha kwa sababu ya muda na watu wetu wengi wanasafiri kuelekea Nyamira wengine Kisi wengine Nairobi uh, ningependa ni Asante sana baba Barokia kwa uongozo wako. Bwana Bege Bindevi. Eh? Baroko ndio hiyo. Eh, biango ngote mande. Ero biego zero bia. All right, thank you. Sasa ningependa ni nataka msimame tu hivyo mpiwe picha as we wait for the Okay. From where? Asante sana. Msimame mpiwe picha tafadhali, msimame tu hivyo. Harakisha harakisha please. Mwelekezi utawaweka vizuri alafu wapiwe picha hiyo itakuwa vizuri. Please please. Songe nyuma kidogo hivyo. That's good. Hapo sawa. That's good. Iko sawa kabisa. Salamu baadaye tafadhali salamu baadaye asante sana Director please salamu baadaye please All right thank you so much picha ndio hiyo Familia ya Teresia Nyakerario Teresia Nyakerario mko stand by Colleagues colleagues wa Regina wako wapi Colleagues wa Regina Colleagues 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 wa Regina kama wako. Colleagues. Colleagues wako. Check one, check one. Kuna wale ambao wanafanya kazi na Regina Nyaboke, tafadhali mkimbie. Naomba mkimbie tafadhali. Wale ambao mnafanya kazi na Regina mkimbie tafadhali. Mkimbie tafadhali kwa heshima, mkimbie hivyo. Colleagues ndio hawa wanao ambao wanafanya kazi na Regina. Asante sana kwa kufika. Ayaangalia tupigwe picha salamu baadaye tafadhali kwa heshima. Salamu baadaye. Asante sana. Kwa sawa hivyo. Asante sana. Naomba sasa tukae. Teresia Nyakerario, familia ya Teresia Nyakerario mkuje hapa. Teresia tafadhali mkuje hapa. Teresia, why is Teresia? Teresia kwa wapi? Yeye ni mzaliwa wa tatu wa mzee kuje msimame hapa. Alright, I would like to recognize the two ladies here. Hawa ndio wameshughulikia mzee sana. Ako wapi yule nas? Ako wapi tafadhali ningependa ukuje? Naitwa nani? Moses. Moses where is Moses? Moses tunashukuru sana kwa kazi ambayo ulifanya kwa mzee bariki. Asante sana. Msimame hapo hivyo mkipiwa picha. Hawa ndio walikuwa wanashughulikia mzee na ni vizuri tu appreciate. Thank you so much for the good work. God bless you. Thank you so much. Asante sana. All right. Uh, sasa ako wapi Teresia Nyakerario? Teresia simame hapa na kile kikundi chote kimeitanishwa na Teresia wasimame hapa hivi. Simame hapo mpiwe picha tafadhali na asante sana kwa kusimama na dada yetu Teresia wala ambao umetoka mbali na karibu hapo hivyo mwelekezi utatuambia utaratibu huo that's good that's good tuelekeza haraka haraka tukipigwa picha kwa kumbukumbu ya mzee hii ni muhimu sana kwa sababu hatutakuwa na wakati mwingine tena wa kusherekea mzee That's good. Asante sana. Tukiharakisha hivyo. Teresia, Tim Teresia Nyakerario ndio hawa wamesimama. Tunapigwa picha tu hivyo. Alafu tutulie kabisa. Bado tuko kanisani wale ambao mnaongea tutulie kabisa. We will take at most 10 minutes.
kwa karibu kumaliza songe nyuma tafadhali kidogo hivyo that's good that's good mwelekezi tafadhali utatupia kama tuko sawa oh, that's good the family families first and then colleagues later that's okay sir proceed asante sana mpiga picha tuwashukuru sana kama iko sawa utaniambia iko sawa we will appreciate good work thank you so much asante sana team uh, teresia colleagues wa teresia wako wapi colleagues wa teresia colleagues wa teresia simame nyuma yake teresia usimame hapo na colleagues wake mahali penye teresia anafanya kazi tuchukue kumbukumbu hiyo na ni muhimu sana ndio wakati unakumbuka wale ambao wamesimama na wewe kama familia that's good colleagues wa teresia ndio hao Naomba kwa tena tutulie kabisa tuko na chakula cha kutosha mtu yeyote asijaribu kutoka kwa sababu chakula sasa tutapeleka wapi jameni tuko na chakula cha kutosha A, familia ya Teresia ndio hao wakipiwa hapo hivyo Asante sana Alright that's good kuna colleagues wa Regina I'm told uh, Regina colleagues wasimame hapa Colleagues wa Regina asante sana mmefanya um, kazi nzuri kusafiri all the way kufika hapa hivi Erbagon Mungu awabariki sana asante kwa kazi nzuri asante kipiwa picha hivyo alafu tuko na team Elvin Mokeira Elvin Mokeira team Elvin all the way from Nyamira County yes asante sana asante sana team Regina Elvin Mokeira akikuja na familia kwanza Elvin Mokeira na familia msimame hapa tafadhali Elvin simama hapa uangalie pale nataka uangalie pale kwa sababu kamera iko pale na wale wote ambao wamekuja kwa sababu ya Elvin Mokeira mwarakishe please mwarakishe and then colleagues be on standby be on standby colleagues itakuwa vizuri hivyo that's good asante sana asante sana mnasimama haraka hivyo mnapigwa picha okay thank you so much au unajua ni kutoka kitengo cha ulinzi na they are always on a lot Sante sana team Elvin Mokeira au wanafanya kazi na Elvin Asante sana Mungu awabariki Sante Alright colleagues Oh Aya etoka tabange film ndivono ndi film yaera Mwenye ndi film kama tukali kwa Mungu wa mambo ya film sasa Tunaweka memory card Oh excuse ni memory card Aya, sante sana um, cameraman ukiwa sawa tuambie that's good that's good that's good that's good that's good asante sana thank you team uh, uh, elvin colleagues colleagues wa elvin mokeira wako wapi yes colleagues wale ambao wanafanya kazi na elvin mokeira wako wapi wamesafiri kutoka jamira all the way from jamira thank you so much yes na, oh nairobi ah oh, alright Team Nairobi hao wamesafiri kutoka Nairobi msimame hapo tafadhali mpasalimiana baadaye Asante sana asante sana thank you so much colleagues of uh, Elvin Mokeira Mungu awabariki smile hivyo naweza smile tu patia Melvin ka smile kidogo hivyo nje kwamba naomboleza that's good Asante Tabitha kwamboka Tabitha kwamboka ako wapi nataka ukuje hapa na familia Tabitha kwamboka simame hapa aya uh, kiwa na CPA CPA ni rafiki yetu sana ila timu Nairobi wamekuja hapo kwa sababu ya CPA yes akina mecha Felix wengine wale wote ila timu Nairobi good work yes nataka mkuti hapa wale wote familia familia yenye nawakilisha Tabitha Kwamboka ndio hawa ini familia ya Tabitha Kwamboka chikore racheito chonsi kurua gachuba that is gachuba au miridi kitutu kitutu masaba na much Asante sana kama hiyo picha imepiwa hivyo itakuwa vizuri. Tabitha Kwamboka ndiyo huyo. Ini timu ya Tabitha Kwamboka. That's good, that's good. Ehe. Hapo sawa kabisa. Very good. Colleagues wako wapi wa Tabitha Kwamboka? Colleagues. All right, that's good. Asante sana. Haya, ako wapi Masi? Masi and colleagues. Masi Kemunto, huyo anaitwa Masi Kemunto. Where are the colleagues? Colleagues wako wapi? Nataka mkimbie tafadhali. Colleagues wa Masi 
ndio masi aone kwamba mmekuja kindly mkuje tu hivyo uh, yes masi ndio huyu masi tunakuombea kabisa Mungu akufariji uh, wakati unapomuomboleza baba yako masi police wa masi ndio hawa ningependa msimame hapa mpiwe picha alafu uh, team doris and family beyond standby Doris Bwari and the family be on standby. Our ni colleagues wa Masi nataka msimame hapo hivyo mpiwe picha salamu baadaye naomba tu. That's good. Thank you so much colleagues for coming all the way. Na asante kwa kufika uh, kufariji dada yenu Maslina Askemunto. Haya ndio hiyo picha ndio hiyo. That's good. That's good. That's good. Thank you so much. Iko sawa? You can confirm to me kindly if we are okay. Kama tuko sawa, utaniambia tuko sawa. Asante sana. Thank you so much colleagues wa Masi. Mungu awabariki sana. Doris Bwari and the family. Is please and the family, familia ya Doris wako wapi? Kuja msimame hapa. Familia ya Doris, mkute nyinyi wote msimame hapa. Tuharakishe tafadhali. Alafu Lilian Doris Doris hakuna colleagues okay this is the family of Doris Doris Bwari msimame hapa Doris mama hapo hivyo muharakishe tafadhali naomba tu asante sana kwa kuwa watifu na asante kwa kufika kuomboleza na uh, Doris God bless you so much tusimame hapo hivyo tupiwe picha hii ni muhimu sana ni muhimu sana muhimu sana asante ehe Doris nataka usimame hapo katikati hapo sawa that's good that's good iko sawa kabisa Bila niliwambia tuko na chakula cha kutosha watu wasiwe na haraka ya kutoka. Kabisa msiwe na haraka ya kutosha ya kuara, ya kutoka. Alright, thank you. Um uh, yes, Doris Wari colleagues, wake wako. Alright, they are not there. Alright, Lilian Kemuma and colleagues. Lilian Kemuma and colleagues, where are they? Lilian Lilian ndio huyu. Kama colleagues wa Lilian wako tafadhali mkimbie, naomba tu kama mpo pale mkimbie where are they and then uh, last but not least cosmos obuge yes so where are the colleague i mean uh, doris where mani kwa lilian lilian right yes lilian colleagues wa lilian tafadhali msimame hapa mwelekeo sisi tutatuambia mahali tutasimama kama tuko sawa hivi lilian simama hapa katikati hivi and then you or the rest of us we can just queue behind lilian songe mbele songa mbele yangu songa mbele yangu tafadhali hivyo thank you so much colleagues wa Lilian asante sana kwa kufika thank you so much for coming and thank you for supporting um dada yetu Lilian Kemuma barikiwe sana picha ndio hiyo picha ndio hiyo taratibu tuko sawa ndugu cameraman we okay or oh, we are good all right minutes All right. Cosmos and family mufwa kwa utaratibu. Familia ya Cosmos is the last born. Huyo ndiye alinyonya maziwa ya mwisho. Kabisa is the last born. Anasimama hapa kwa utaratibu Cosmos Obuge Sheila. Yes, wanasimama hivyo. That's good. Cosmos. Angalia hivyo. That's good. You have colleagues? Family and friends, where are they? Family and friends, where are they? Family and friends of Cosmos. Oh, they are right here. Ah, wangwana wako hapa. Wazee wa nguvu. That's good. Karibu sana. That's good. Ile kamati ya Nairobi wako wapi mkimbia hapa tafadhali? The Nairobi Committee. Nairobi Committee. Nairobi committee mmetusaidia sana. Nyinyi ndio mmetusaidia kusafirisha mwili mpaka hapa. If you are still there. All right. These are colleagues. Asante sana hawa ni colleagues wa Cosmos Ubuge. Barikiwa sana. Kuna dada na ndugu wa James James Nyakundi kama wako hapa ningependa mkuje hapa haraka 
the brother and sister to James, please. Brother and sister to James. Yani ba muraba muabo na basuba tiba muabo James nyakundi ngai more. Chungo kocha kaiga. Ba muraba muabo na basuba tiba muabo e James nyakundi. Chungo kocha nande pole sana soko mosiri mwanu mino. E muta timo tene ne kaiga. Aba na ba muabo James. Aba na ba muabo James. Na ba muraba muabo James. Muta timo tene kocha kaiga. Pole sana soko mosiri ya mwanu mino. E nya saa ba obole mu. Tena gaiga, mwelekezi utotombia vile watasimama. Abana ba mwabo James kabisa. These are brothers and sisters to James. Abana bu mongina. Gomo gaka Jeremia nyariyenga. Abu haba. Ebo no mbia mwona se. Anditu wabasa vile nya saa ba obole mu. Mungu wa wafariji kabisa. As good, as good. Asante sana awa ni ndugu na dada wa muenda zake eh, shudia wetu James Nyakundi. Vile wamesimama hapo hivyo tunasema pole sana. Mungu wa fariji. Mungu awatie nguvu. Asante sana. Wakiendelea hivyo uh, kwa niaba ya familia ya mzee James Nyakundi Nyarienga. Um, na wale wote na kwa niaba ya kanisa. Kanisa katholiki ambayo imetuongoza kwa ibada ya wafu. Na kwa niaba ya kamati ile ambayo likuwa inanda uh, shere ya siku ya leo Mimi narudisha shukrani zangu Awa ntoba ito goro gongoro Ege saifu ya mtu jitu suku mekeche kuja kabu wangu hika Kwa suku matole ege sakeche ka Na inu mwakuwa na mwewe kana Kwa temande sana asinko nyara Kuno motenidu ege saifu ya mtu jitu suku mekeche ka hika Nwe karumo kukuwa na mangana ino amangana ino uwe kana Erubia kwa serubia. Bia mwano sana nko kendeke samba ama higa. Mbate nga wantuwe ribago nimbu ya bale. Thank you so much. Alright. Nimeambiwa kuna ndugu na dada. Wa. Wa the late. Nora. Wako wapi. Brothers and sisters, where are they? Wako hapi? Tafadhali mkuje, tafadhali. Naomba tu mkuje. Na semo musimame hapa. Semo musimkwesta, musimame hapa tafadhali. Kisemo musimame hapa na wale dada, ndugu wa Mama Nora tafadhali mkuje hapa. Mwarakishe naomba tu kwa heshima. Oh, pole sana. Baba kwa kutufumilia. God bless. Thank you. Aya, tusimame sasa. Tusimame wako hapi wale ndugu, dada wa Nora. Namba tu musimame hapa. Musimame hapa kwanza alafu chisemo. Chisemo mufuwa tatafadhali. Chisemo musienda tatafadhali. Musimame hapa. Kwa sababu mukienda itakuwa makosa. Very good. Thank you so much. Aya. Awa ni ndugu dada wa uh, our mom, the late Nora Mora. The dear wife to Mze um, James Nyakundi Nyadienga. Ndiyo awa musimame hapa. Sante sana. Thank you. Thank you so much. Asante kwa kutupatia ah, msichana mrembo sana. Mbaye ya mezaa awa watoto wa mzee James Nyakundi. Tula shukuru sana. Very good. Thank you so much. Chisemo nga ibale. Chisemo kujeni tafadhali. Chisemo. Very good. Chisemo. Welekezi wangu kama kuna kikundi ni mesau. Tafadhali. Lakina fikiri tuko sawa sasa. I think we are good. Eh? Very good. Thank you. Chisemo. Chisemo msimame hapo hivo. Asante sana chisemo musimame hapo tafadhali hivyo. Mwelekezi utatuambia chisemo wako hapo ndio wao wamesimama. These are semos. Makibana dokoro kajisemi kezeke zwairi kezongo. Makibana dokoro kwa. At semos ye. Yeah? Aya these are the semos. Yes. The semos are right here. Semos wako hapo. Mwelekezi utatuambia vile tutapiwa hiyo picha haraka haraka. That's good. Chisemo, very good. Chisemo ndio hiyo. Chisemos. Aya, semos. Semos, muna sumari kitoku, muna angalia picha pale. 
Angalia picha pale hivyo. Very good. Thank you Semos. Asante sana. Very good. Thank you. This is this is a Cosmos uh, of Woge family all the way from Meru. Ndio wamefika saa hii. Kwa hivyo kama wamefika kutoka Meru. Oh, thank you so much. These are the Cosmos of Woge family from Meru. Thank you so much. Wakisimama hapo hivyo wapiwe picha. Very good. Mwelekezi wangu na kikundi nimesahau. Atuko sawa sasa. Oh very good very good very good thank you so much haya ndio hiyo picha sasa ndio hiyo alafu picha zingine tutaendelea baadaye tutaendelea na picha zingine baadaye na ni ile nilikuwa nimewaelekeza tafadhali tuko na chakula cha kutosha watu wasiwe na haraka ya kutoka ndaga ratubu ati saini yes asante sana father james marube mungu akubariki sana naona ndani nimeitwa james because of james eh Thank you. I'm in Batiza leo another name. Okay, sasa hivi nilikuwa nimesimama hapa kwa karibu na Chisemo. Nikakuta nyama zeni nitaandika noise makers. Tumsifu Yesu Kristo. Tumsifu Yesu Kristo. Father Vincent ameni introduce naitwa Father Michael Morioki, padri wa Jimbo la Nakuru. Nahudumia Cory Cross Shabab familia poleni. Kwa watu wote tumesoma mengi kutoka kwa James juu ya ukarimu wake. Mungu atujalie tuweze kuuiga. Asante Mungu awabariki. Tumsifu Yesu Kristo. Basi nami pia kwa hapa ya mapadri ambao walifanya kazi huko gekano mahari e, mzee James Nyakundi ametoka e, tumeleta rambi rambi zetu kutoka huko kisi kwa familia na kuambia tuko pamoja e, mzee ameandika kitabu kizuri e, kila mmoja wetu asome na ajue kila anaweza kufanya katika maisha na tena e, kile ningependa e, mulisikia wimbo wa katikati kutoka Zaburi 27 kitu kimoja alikuwa naomba ni kwamba akae katika nyumba ya Bwana siku zote za maisha yake hata wakati Nora alimtangulia akaenda mapema e, tunasema ya kwamba hilo ndilo jambo yeye mkiongea na yeye anataka kukaa katika nyumba ya Bwana siku zote za maisha yake e, kwa hivyo akitafakari mazuri ya Bwana e, Mwenyezi Mungu aipokee roho yake mahali pema peponi na msafiri salama e, mtakapo rudi e, tuko pamoja nataka kuhakikishia kwamba tutazidi kuombea mwe kitu kimoja e, mwe na sura ya mzee ambaye ameenda asante Tumsi Peace Christian uh, wale yote tunapenda kumshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa siku hii ya leo ambaye aliona ni vema ampumzishe nyakundi kwa namna ya pekee na mkumbuka mama Nora Manola alikuwa kama godmother wangu. Alinisimamia kwenye sherehe yangu ya mwisho Januari mwaka huu mwaka uliopita mwezi wa tatu akasafiri. Basi mimi na imani ya kwamba na mombaji. Kwa hivyo Mungu azidi kuwabarikiwa na familia na Mr. Nyakundi kwa kweli amekuwa ta na azidi kama anavyo alivyong'aa na sisi tuzidi kung'aa. Njasa Marietha, Sister Naomi, Muige, Angweni. Mbarikiwe sana. Na sister Asante kwa kuja na ukatutengenezea altari yetu siku ya leo. Uh, vote of thanks. No silate story ni vote of thanks. Asante. <laughs> Nikumpere ya kanisa. 
nimetoa kofi asante basi eh, ni kwanza kabisa kanisa tunasema ni asante sana asante sana kabisa eh, ninaanza na eh, fata murioki asante sana mzee alipokuwa mgonjwa pale Nairobi tulikuita na ukakuja kwa haraka sana na ukarala pale nyumbani ukakaa na mzee kwa muda mrefu sana asante sana we are so humbled na tulipofika na kuru umash pia ulikatisha shughuli zako sote na ukafika pale ukatupokea tunasema ni asante sana makanisa yote na machilani asante sana pale hospitali wale ambao walitushughulikia sana asante sana our relatives asante sana tunasema ni asante kabisa na kanisa ya nyumbani hapa asante kubwa sana ningependa kuachia hapa na kanisa pale mahali mzee alitoa samba senti jacinta dia nyakundi tunawashukuru sana mmefanya kazi ya muhimu sana jana tumekuwa na misa nzuri sana na mlitusaidia asante sana god bless you all thank you so much Mungu yumwema kila wakati kwa hivyo tunashukuru kwa kufika karibu tamati ningependa pia kupeana tangazo moja tu tukimaliza ibada ya misa tumeona tumeelezwa kwamba chakula kipo ambacho tutala na wale ambao wote tuko hapa tutapiga foleni hapo tutapewa chakula wala ambao tutaelekea kule chini kwa kaburi ni wanaume wote wasie mekei ambao tabeba mwili tukienda nao wanakwaya na familia nafasi huko chini si kubwa kwa hivyo wengine kizia hapa tule chakula cha, cha mcha na tuende nyumbani mwisho pia ni shukuru wote wa kanisa ambao wameshirikiana nao na ninawaona wako hapa mwenye CW nyinyi wote Mujue kwamba tumewarecognize na tumejua kazi nzuri mmefanya hata chairman wa jumuiya hii ambaye alikuwa pia ndio chairman wa kamati na kamati yako tunawavulia kofia mbarikiwe na asanti sana kwa kazi nzuri nami nachukua fursa hii kushukuru kila mtu ambaye amefika hapa mkienda muende salama salmini Mungu awabariki na msisahau uzuri wa nyakundi nanyi pia tenda mema nenda zako Mungu ndiye atakulipa barikiweni Asante. Asante innocent. Asante. Asante mapadri kwa kujumuika pamoja na asia. Asante ni sana. Kwaya. Asante. Asante ni sana eh? Asante chairman. Atuwe ndio mfupi sana katika nini yetu. Ya asante. Thank you. Umefanya kazi nzuri sana na komiti yako. Chairman wa wanaume, thank you. Minai. Asante. Asante Minai. Muridhi asante ni sana. Okongo asante ni. Asante ni sana. Ningetaja kila mtu jina lakini wacha tu niwaachie hapo. Felix Asante. Kwaya, Maina Asante ni sana. Na Steve, thank you very much. Eh, sama service, thank you very much, eh. Familia, asante kwa kutupea mzee Nyakundi. Sasa nyinyi ndio mlitupea, si ndio? Na mmekaa na eh hospital. Thank you very much. Na huyu jamaa is always saying yeye ndio kitinda mimba. So kitinda mimba, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much, eh. And thank you. And that order was very nice. Asante ni sana waze. Thank you, thank you very much. Muna porudi, murudi, salama. We pray for you. Na mwe mkitutembelea tena. Karibu ni sana, sindio? Tasa tunombe hii familia, ikae mzu, mzuri. That's our prayer. Today, kila mtu waombe hii familia. Sasa, tumefika salazetu za mwisho. Na naomba, wale wachakula, musianze kukula saaita. Fadhali, mungoja at least tutupote kidogo, sindio? Tuende kidogo, musianze kukula tu saaita. At least mtupe nafasi wale ambao tunateremuka kule chini. Aya sasa kwaya simama. Alafu sasa tuingie sala zetu za mwisho ngojeni kidogo tutaenda paka pale kwa ukimia. Tutakuwa kwa kimia sana wakati huu tuko kwa ukimia sana.
leo tunamsindikiza ndugu yetu safari yake ya mwisho ya hapa duniani Mungu alimpa maisha ya duniani na sasa amemwita ili ampe maisha ya mbinguni kesiyo na mwisho mwili wake tunauweka ardhini kama mbegu ya mungu kwa tukuka na roho yake ingie katika milele na kuomba ye bwana umpokee huyu ndugu yetu katika uzima wa milele na utawala wako apate furaha isiyo na mwisho na kukaa miongoni mwa watakatifu na Sasa tumpeleke ndugu yetu makaburini twatumaini kuwa siku moja tutakutana naye katika uzima mpya. Bwana awe nanyi. Awe Mungu Mwenyezi, Baba na Mwana na Roho Mtakatifu. Ende na amani Mwenyezi Mungu abarikaze ya mikono yenu.
Mwavuli, 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 kitabu, kitabu. Hapo mwavuli, Tuombe wazima na wafu Dugu zangu tumuombe kwa unyenyekevu Mungu Baba Mwenyezi kwa ajili ya dugu zetu waliofariki. Twakuomba utusikie. Twakuomba utusikie. Mungu upende kuwasamehe na dhambi zao. Twakuomba utusikie. Wasafiri hapa duniani Mungu Mwenyezi atukarimie katika na kutudumisha katika utumishi wake mwaminifu. Twakuomba utusikie. Twakuomba utusikie. E Mungu Mwenyezi na mkombozi, kwa imani tunasadiki kifo na ufufuko wa mwanao. Tunamuomba tunakuomba utujalie sisi na dugu zetu marehemu tukafika katika furaha na tunaomba hayo kwa jina ya Kristo Bwana wetu. Amen. Baadaye. Acha tumie ujuzi wao tuwape nafasi. Sasa chekeza tumemwezana. Wape nafasi mtumie ujuzi wenu eh. Wewe machini kama zenu upoke upoke alikutumikia mpoke bwana Mpoke, mpoke, ali kutumikia, mpoke 
Poke, poke, ali buto mikia. Nasi mama apa mana ini depan ini? Ibu, apa apa non? Sama. Mana dia mau buri jap? Dia mau buri. Macam mau buri. Kita buat. Siapa? Sorry. Menyesi mungu. Amependa kumuita kwa ke James kutoka kwenye uzima huu. Mwili wake tunaweka udongoni urudi kulikotoka. Kristo amefufuka wa kwanza kutoka kwa wafu. Tunamkabidhi ndugu yetu James kwa Bwana. Bwana ampokee katika amani yake na mwili wake ufufue siku ya mwisho. Katika maji ulibatizwa James. Mungu akamirishe ndani yako 
yale aliyoanzisha katika ubatizo wako mwili wako ulikuwa hekalu la Mungu tunamuomba tuna akupe amani mapadri 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 wewe ni uvumbi unarudi katika uvumbi lakini Bwana akufufue siku ya mwisho. Familia, familia sasa. Ni wakati wa familia tuwapatie nafasi. Kidogo tu. Kidogo tu dadi. Kuja nyuma. Ama nikae tu hapa. Acha nikae hapa. Hata hapa. Ni afadhali.
kwamba maisha ya hapa duniani ni mafupi na ya kwamba hatujui tutakufa lini. Roho wako mtakatifu atuongoze katika utukufu na haki siku zote za maisha yetu. Tutafika salama katika ufano wako kwa jina ya Kristo bwana wetu. Raha ya milele umpe bwana. Apumzike kwa amani. Raha ya milele umpe James e bwana. Apumzike kwa amani. Amina. kubariki msalaba huu. Niandikwe ishara ya mwokozi wetu Yesu Kristo aliyekubariki kwa ishara hii. Niandikwe ishara ya mwokozi wetu Yesu Kristo aliyekukomboa kwa ishara hii. Upumzike kwa amani. Naangalia sasa. Funga. Wimbo. Kwa dhamarude. Yes. Inaangalia Saidi ile. Eh. Bwana awe nanyi awe Abariki Mungu Mwenyezi Baba na Mwana na Roho Mtakatifu Amina Ibada yetu ya mazishi imekwisha kaeni na amani Tumshukuru Mungu na chukua nafasi hii kumshukuru sana baba paroko kwa kunipa nafasi hii. Tunashukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa nguvu ambayo anazidi kuwapa familia na tazidi kuwaombea kwamba Mungu azidi kuwapa nguvu wakati huu. Tutawaombea tuendelee kuwa na umoja na upendo ambao tumedumisha wakati huu. Taomba MC baada ya padri akisema MC atachukua nafasi baada ya kutusaidia kuweka maua. Asante. Asante Father. Asante umesafiri nasi tangu jana katika hii safari hata kutoka hospitali tunaambia father asante wakati uliniambia unakuja i was very happy na asante umekuwa pamoja nasi na mahali unaenda pia Mungu azidi kubariki amen asante sasa mc yako wapi atuongoze kwa maua atuongoze kwa kuweka maua it is normally the church itaanza father murioki and myself tutaweka then the family now si ndio sasa utatuongoza haya Innocent. Mungu umema kila wakati. Kila wakati. Ningeomba kipindi kifupi cha maua. Kuwa lile la msalaba ni ua la kanisa ningeomba lirepe la kwanza tusaidiwe na padri. Na chama na Na mwenyekiti wa Watoto wa James. Hiyo ndio next. Hamna ya moyo. Hata hii tutaweka tu sawa ila shida. Na kutaenda kuja kuleta basila kubwa. Ile kubwa ndio ni wako hapo. Wajukuu wa mzee 
wajibu ku wacha waeta wao alafu ni waeta nyumba wajuku na ungeweka hiyo saidi nyingine eh ungeweka hii saidi nyingine weka tu hiyo saidi sawa on your pizza by the wanapiga ifuate hiyo si hata ungeshika hata mimi eh Hai mungependwa hivi kwa sababu iko inform of bahati iangalie juu penduke hivi Mhm mm hii sehemu iende hivi chini Eh yeah. ba hivyo Eh Aya next Ngoja hao wamalize kwanza kuna nyingine hapo Aya nyingi pia Ya wajukuu itakaa hapa katikati nyisa ndio mbeka hapo Sasa wajukuu wote wakuja washirikiane hii wataeka hapo katikati Wajukuu Aya uko nyuma Aya sasa kuna ile ilikuwa maua moja moja Aha sawa enda yeka hii pande hii Sasa tuko kwa ndugu wa James ndugu wa James Kuja uweke na hiyo side huko Ndugu wa James Mweke 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 Apea na hiyo ambre la kushikie Mkona zingine hapo Aya next weka tu Aya next weka Mimi ni mweka ya familia Mweka ya familia Mweka ya familia Watu wale dada wa maremu Sisters to Mr. James Dada wa maremu Kuja hindi pia nini muonekane Next uko Mweka hata hapo karibu Mweka mbele ya hao Sasa hii ni kila mtu Hiyo pereka uko na hii lete pande nani hajaweka maua ah mimi yako karibu wa familia na hajaweka maua familia na hujaweka maua haya pea huyu pea pea chairman yes aita wote ongana hii eh kapande eh Aya mwingine mmoja Pita huku Aya hawa wengine tutachukua hii ya moja moja Entawatea, tawatea Gwaja wa marizo hiyo Aya ambera hikuwa ya nani Chairman, umeka Chukua ambera Asa hawa ingine wote tutaweka yetu Kwa hana kwa hana kwa hana Shika shika mbera ya Aya Kuna zingine hapa tuchukue moja moja The others sasa Tuchukue uwa moja moja Na kila mtu ataetu Wanakuwa ya muku tu ma representative Representative
Tupita wengine hivi Kuna nafasi huku Mr. Mureidi Ujeni na hivi Ujeni na huku Ya yote ambaye ako na uwa unakaribishwa wanakuwaya tunawangoja baada hapa tunashukuru wote na Mungu awabariki Thank you.